day 23, I'm still blocked on Twitter. <laughs> it's true. I've been saying something very vile to open this up. Don't! We I'm need people it. who like us. <laughs> <laughs> Imagine if our Twitch rep is just like, you know, you know, that 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 D D group, we should check in and see how they're doing. Talking to the the lady was really nice. I wonder what their streams are like. And then just Connor just we just start the stream and Connor just screams like penis at the top of his lungs. Yeah. It could be the fart reverb. God, that's bad that's better, honestly. It's tame, honestly. What about the, the gnome one? It, it has to be gnome with a fucking disastrously no. fart reverb thing. No, it's oh my bust God. a nut one. To bust a nut I, one. To bust a nut, just hold down B button until fully charged, then release. <laughs> you can use it to defeat enemies. <laughs> Diggy Gas needs your help. Give him your wacky digits. So oh my god. You, you brought up the gnome, and I, I fucking laughed my ass off whenever he went, <laughs> ah! Oh, and then it's just <laughs> diarrhea. <laughs> it's better than the oh no kid in the stall at school. Oh, that one's good too. That one, oh no! Oh no! <laughs> you okay in there? <laughs> hey everyone, welcome back to Unexpectables. This is our fart stream now. The man just shat his soul out. Have, no, he is not okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh goodness! Someone said the first time watching live. This is awesome. Is this awesome? <laughs> is this is this awesome? Heliospirus. <laughs> were you what? Were you curious when watching, like listening to like the podcast or the or, or something? Going, I wonder what the pre-stream talk is like. I bet they're they're very insightful and philosophical. My old pork is butthole. <laughs> Why was that Hank? Uh, I don't know. That dang old pork is butthole. <laughs> what? Uh, I hate how good that is. It's, it's I love it. how good that is. <laughs> That's just <Con> toilet sounds. <laughs> what was that about? We have fun here. Yeah. We do, yeah. At, at the heart of it all, it is a D&D &D game with friends, so, you know. The, the, only thing, only thing, the only thing we were, we're missing from this equation is the pizza and the beer. God yeah, damn it, I was gonna say that, Zeno. We need expired snacks that we got at like a 7 Eleven, like right Grandma, from the game. Grandma's hard candy she gave you back in 95. No, yeah. we, need the, we need the That's toilet that pizza shit. that we found behind the stall. Get the no. no, toilet pizza does not. No. Should we go around the horn? Yeah, we probably <laughs> should. Uh, so. uh, Bosco, where can I find you? What are you up to? You can find me on twitch.tv slash theropodart and at theropod underscore art on Twitter. Please come and support me. I recently left my job because I want my joints to work when I'm 30. So I'm currently streaming commissions and taking them consistently. <laughs> so if you'd like me to draw your dinosaur Sona or anything else, but I'd love it if it was a dinosaur, please swing on by. Also, if you have artwork, feel free to join my Discord and throw it up on the fridge at the end of every art stream. I typically show that stuff off to the community and we could take a look at your stuff. <clears throat> also, What's your if you're interested pictures? in watching any of the episodes after they air, you could typically find me streaming some art while listening to either the Unexpectables or Gateway of the Prince Division. If you don't know what those last two are, you should tune in on Saturdays. Holy crap, does that mean you can draw my OC character, Therapod? I, sh uh, I sure can. I've, uh, like I said, I, I recently left my job, so I will draw whatever you want me to, really, if you pay me money. Wow, and with I have a, a lot of money to work with. <laughs> Whoa! I can draw that, actually. Excellent. <laughs> Proportionally, too, if you'd like. Right. Or I could do some macro Excellent. stuff if you'd like. There you go. <laughs> well, thank you, Pharaoh. Uh, Gaijin, where can they find you? What are you Sitting doing? here laughing because I love Wednesdays. I just get to hear all the jokes from the professional people. Uh, <laughs> you, find you find me at twitch.tv slash Gaijin Cooper every Tuesday, Saturday, Sunday, 7 p.m. Mio Central. Uh, I, we beat the shit out of Monster Hunter Rise for now, so I think we're good for a bit. Um... Mm -hmm. So Pokemon Arceus is coming out Friday. I will be streaming that um, Saturday and Sunday because, I mean, dude, it's like Taisho period Hokkaido, like before the MSG people were completely driven out of it. So, yeah, I'm all about that. 
Uh, I have been dueling around with Tokiden Kiwami because I fucking love that game and it's very unappreciated. Um, aside from that, got a new video coming out hopefully this weekend. Got one more Monster Hunter Rise video left in me talking about the Agnesom, where I argue, literally argue with myself for 10 minutes. It's gonna be great. Uh, aside from that, oh, uh, I don't know if I can announce it just yet, but I have a very, very special indie, um, dev requested stream next Tuesday. Uh, I might be able to go more into that, but uh, I, th I think I have to keep it hush-hush right now. Okay, so I, I just want you to imagine Ori in the Blind Forest, but it's Japanese. Kind of. I think I know what you're talking about. Yeah, I think you do too. The devs actually came up to me like, hey, we're longtime fans of yours, and we designed our, our characters and monsters based off of your information. Do you want to stream our game? <laughs> uh... You have sure. big shoes to fill. Ah! Okay, that's me. Kiwami means extreme. Uh, Zito, where can they find you? And what are you up to? You know, find me at twitch.tv slash Zito, where I play indie games, uh, a lot of modded games, anything that where I can like get into the code and draw or make things stupid. Uh, Next couple of games I'm looking to actually give a try is uh, Lucket Town, uh, Intravenous, and bu 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 bu, I'm looking at this one right here. Yep, this is the one I want. Steam. Okay, there it is. Mortal Online 2 kind of looks neat. I don't know what the fuck it's about, but I want to try it. Uh, this is all just waiting until Elden Ring comes out, so I will be streaming the shit out of that. Uh, beyond that, I'm going to post this funny thing because uh, constantly telling people about my Patreon and supporting it for more more of my homebrew D&D &D content uh, that isn't going to get updated on DMs Guild, so all that stuff's legacy, so if you want the updated shit, you should probably go to my Patreon, uh, which is the Ever Ingot Almanac, but, you know, if that's too much information for you to grasp at one point, here's this funny little Twitter post I made. <laughs> is that the May Maze? It, 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 listen... Telling people about my Patreon it just isn't fucking working anymore, so I tried a different tactic. Meme. Memes. I touch the dog, memes. I am, okay, last last thing. I am working on something called Dreamer. My thing I'm working on on uh, Patreon right now is called Dreamers of Fiction, where I ask uh, some of my more common artists that I use in my books uh, to draw a race without telling me or showing me until it's complete and it is my job to create meta based around it to make it playable some of it is easy some of it is fun to write for some of it is challenging as fuck to make playable but i will do my best give me ten dollars so student loans don't kill me Monty, where can they find you, and what are you up to? Uh, you can find me. Also, be sure to be reasonably loud, because I have you max at 200%, and you're still quite quiet, so just gotcha. don't, be afraid to, don't be afraid to raise your voice a little bit more. Um, you can find me at Monty Glue on Twitter, and you can find me at twitch.tv forward slash Monty Glue. Uh, God damn it, God damn it, God damn it, God damn it. I lost two Pokemon right before Cynthia, and now I have to make an entire, like, new team. I have to grind, which is rough. But um, I probably actually might not end up streaming Pokemon Arceus. I don't think I'm going to have time to. My streams are going to kind of have to take the, the back seat for a while. But um, tomorrow, we're going to have Dungeon the Mad Mage. We're back. Zora and the Bear has returned to us, even though I don't like bears. But um, we have uh, the entire gang back. They're on the second layer of the dungeon. Um, I believe they left off and they were spotted by a beholder. So if you want to see how that goes, yeah, they turned the corner and they met with a beholder. So is, it, is this a funny hoo hoo ba beholder or the default I hate everything beholder? We're doing it as written, so you you can conclude. Uh, give uh, a goldfish. You decide. But, but yeah, so definitely check that out tomorrow. It should be a really fun time. Uh, and then Sunday, if I do stream, I will maybe stream Pokemon again. I, I'm going to be kind of a mess for the next month or so. So 
thank you for your patience. I will try and do my best as much as I can, but I do need to grind and I do not want to grind. I don't want to stream grinding. It's so boring. I want to lie in bed and do it because while well, I can do something else because I don't want to have to stream it. I'm sorry. A lot of people are like, well, just stream it. And I'm like, no, I don't want to have to try and fill the space while I'm just fighting the same thing over and over again. But yeah. Thumb, thumb, thumbs up. All right. Uh, they can find me on Twitter, Twitch, and YouTube.com slash Distortion Double. I stream Tuesdays, Fridays, Saturdays, and Sundays. Uh, rest of this week, streams <clears throat> might be a bit dubious, but I, I will uh, make an attempt. Uh, yes, as, as some of you may be aware, my, my Discord account was compromised, and I am now on a temporary account, and I need to get that sorted before I figure out too much <clears throat> other stuff. Yes. Uh, but other than that, I do that uh, streaming Tuesdays, Fridays, Saturdays, and Sundays. Be sure to check out Dead House Sonata. Uh, click the link, purchase the Founders Pack if you want to play the dead to fight the living. And also check out my DMs Guild, uh, where I am releasing 5th edition content. Uh, just released the Warpath Barbarian, and I was going to uh, hold a poll to choose what the next one was going to be. But I might have to wait on that one as well. Yeah. Uh, but yes, uh, that's it for me. Um, I'd like to thank our wonderful sponsor for this evening's escapades, Die Hard Dice. And hopefully, they're nice to us tonight. And hopefully, well, roll roll twenty has been saving up a bit of goodwill. Hopefully as well. But yes, now, now you've said it, you've completely fucked yourself. Uh, die Hard Dice uh, is your one stop shop for dice and dice accessories. They've got dice towers. They've got rolling uh, trays. They've got carrying cases. They've got scrolls you can fit your minis into and also your dice as well. Uh, get the complete package. They've also got a lot of cool uh, new dice that are. Uh, rolling their way down the pipeline. Uh, be sure to check them out if you want either polymer or metal dice. Head on over to dieharddice.com and use the code UNEXPECTABLES! Exclamation point to save 10% on your order at dieharddice.com. And with that, it's time to read out some... Uh, Dr. Dank Memes, PhD, thank you for the 14 months. Erwin Elf, thank you for the 18 months. A Cat Named Garbage, thank you for the 12 months of Tier 2. Oh look, a year. Shadow Flare 8, thank you for the 22 months. Ex Machinus, thank you for the 15 months of Prime. Bag of Holding, thank you for the 22 months. Have to watch the VOD because of my work schedule, but have a good session tonight, guys. Kick some zealot ass. Pentageddon, thank you for the 13 months. It's okay, Ooh, unexpectables. Uh, last, protect me while I drive through Oklahoma snows. Ooh, good luck, buddy. <laughs> Zanwind, thank you for the 20 months. Uh, don't change, you wonderful people. Good luck on your rolls tonight. The Fox of Death, thank you for the five months of Prime. Nitro's Nexus, thank you for the 500 bits. Uh, just realized Borky is the cosmic Kiryu of this world. No? They both have black hair, though. <clears throat> Advocate Devil, thank you for the 200 bits. I've been looking forward to this episode. The UCO is about to suffer some unexpected consequences for messing with Alabast. Uh, uh, pseudonym McFake Name, thank you for the. Oh my god! <laughs> uh, but enough about me. Let's chill you. <laughs> Uh, Puffer, thank you for the, er, uh, yeah, Puffer 6, thank you for the Prime sub for 19 months. Cosmosis 45, thank you for the 100 bits. I want to hear Connor try to do serious RP in the Hank Hill voice, or his scene partner keep a straight face. I did that in, in did my that. Thursday game. Yeah, it was awesome. Yeah. I tell you, what? Uh, <laughs> Eagle with a Deagle, thank you for the 300 bits. Uh, good luck tonight, guys. Kick some sun butt. I'll catch you in the VODs. Draconian 9, thank you for the 20 months. Antelaris, thank you for the raid of the party of two. Fucknut2313, thank you for the 500 bits. <laughs> Guys, I'm back. Hi. Hi. 
Uh, Cyberheart420, thank you for the six months. Morthrandor, thank you for the nine months. Good luck, everyone. Have a nice session. Uh, vamos inesperables. Uh, Bella, X Bella X3, thank you for the 16 months. Hello, everyone. Good luck tonight. Wishing you good rolls. Just landed my interview for a new career and hoping my good luck passes to you all. Ooh. Well, congratulations. Congrats. <clears throat> Dumb Reject, thank you for the 22 months. It's that time again. A Cat Named Garbage, thank you for the 500 bits. I'm back. I forgot I had a pun uh, just for Goomba. What's the mm. difference between a rogue and a monk? <laughs> Fuck you, garbage! <laughs> <laughs> now he knows what he does. He knows what he does when he comes to my streams and drops a bunch of money like a generous bastard and then obliterates me with puns. Fuck you, what? garbage. What? You and your top what? kick. What's the difference? I don't know! <laughs> a, rogue will, a rogue will pick the lock, but a monk will just use his key. Uh, <laughs> I suffer from this almost every every one of my streams. Every single one. Plus I love, one. I, I love um, that, actually. That's actually a really good joke. Uh, <laughs> Flustered bun. Thank you for the 100 bits. Good evening, everyone. Good luck tonight. I bless all of your rolls uh, all the way to Saturday. I can't be here tonight because I got my blood drawn and I'm really tired. Also, Discord, give Connor his account back. Also, yay, Gaijin. Yeah. Uh, I am Spike. Thank you for uh, giving a sub to Wee Woo 2017. <laughs> uh, happy nobody. Fuck. Thank you for the 18 months of crime, <laughs> Savage. Uh... Jinty13, thank you for the 12 months. <laughs> Protoss103, thank you for the 5 bits. I have to work at 1 p.m. I will take a point of exhaustion. Ooh. Uh, Norviticus, thank you for the 50 bits. Gaijin, there are no professionals here. Uh, oh, fuck. Oh, my God, it's him. It's Vince Baba Ganoush with the Prime sub. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. I hope all the way from MXC. I, I, I'm a big fan of your work. <laughs> oh. uh, Sergeant Tucker, thank you for the 60 bits. Uh, what's uh, what's the new Japanese show about the psycho murder bear with the horns and the super strength? Yokai bear? Gaijin would know. Uh, I'll be right back. I'm going to get water. Gaijin, it's unbearable. You have to know these things. No! I know where you live. Right you are, Ken. Uh, uh, Bill MSU, thank you for the 20 months. Uh, Tactical Hagrid, thank you for gifting five subs. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, Faceless42, thank you for the 31 bits. Good luck, everyone. Death to the false speaker. Uh, Broton Rod, thank you for the 22 months. Good luck, unexpected. These names are that great. One, that one blind kid, thank you for the 19 months. Yeah. Akazar, thank you for the 18 months. Got my booster today, and I am actively dying. Ah, yes. I know that mm. feel. I still haven't that. gotten an email about that. I'm pretty sure my second shot was like a super shot. Hmm. Well, your third mm. one's going to be a doozy then. No, I don't get a third one because the second shot had all the shit in it, apparently. Uh. I got I got my second shot really late to the point where I was getting emails from the government going, your employer legally has to let you get your shot. And I was like, I'm my employer. <laughs> well, you better do it. You got to sue yourself yeah. for holding you back. Right? <laughs> you really should. Not Dante42, thank you for the 22 months. Uh, Elf Lord 89 thank you for the 19 months of Prime. 18 months, can't watch tonight. Uh, but I'll catch you guys in the VOD on Saturday night. Uh, thanks as always, you guys. Love you. Drew1, Drew1, thank you for the 1,000 bits. First time Twitch bits, just wanted to say thank you all for this wonderful campaign and story. Got me through some tough times and a lot of boring shifts over the past few years. Yeah. Away. Yeah. Uh, JM00789, thank you for the 20 months. Hey, I'm finally on here live for once. Buy a Die Hard Dice. They sent me a handwritten note blessing my new dice after my old dice betrayed me when I needed them the most. Also drink water. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Should we mention what, what did uh, Diana mention in the meeting with the Die Hard oh Dice? Uh-huh. So apparently, um, and again, when you guys are putting in, like, you know, how did you find out about the dice? 
Apparently, some people were putting in to appease Diana, and so I guess Sales, like, contacted her and was like, what are you doing? And she goes, I don't know. Are you, like, threatening people? Yeah, they asked if she was threatening people. And she's like, no, and then they managed to find that it was us, and it was like, oh shit, sorry. So don't, don't leave menacing comments. Okay? Don't leave cryptic <laughs> fucking threatening messages at the people who give us... Oh. She took it in stride, and, and apparently now. Sales had a good laugh about it, but, you know. <laughs> it's just, you know, it's it's all good, but just something kind of in, funny that happens. I am Spite. Thank you for the 400 bits. After finding you guys two years ago, I finally found time to catch you live. What a hell of a time to catch you. Uh, thanks for the adventures, thanks for the memories, and the Die Hard Dice discount. Yeah. K-Mac Mock with 19 months of Prime. Kidows, thank you for the seven bits. Dragon Alchemist, thank you for the 5,000 bits. Today is my birthday, so I have some bits and beat those United Clergy Zealots. Well, happy birthday. Uh, Connor, We can we end here in the next minute? Is that possible? Yeah. We uh, may not be able to do all of them, but we you need to start, unfortunately. Yeah. All right. Uh, Spectrefall99, thank you for the 1,000 bits. Sonage J, thank you for the 21 months. Kane Ryu, thank you for the 10 months. Uh, Pine the Man, Apple, thank you for the sub. Doom Knight, thank you for the 300 bits. King of Morons, thank you for the 22 months. Pirate Maid 13, thank you for the 20 months. White Fang, thank you for the 20 months of Prime. Wolf then the sixth, thank you for the one or for the eleven months. Werewolf in the Speedo, thank you for the one hundred bits. Yuki Usagi, thank you for the twenty months. Uh, Splitar, thank you for the fifteen months. Zeon the Blue Dragon, thank you for the five bits. Otter with a machete, thank you for the three hundred bits. DDR Russian, thank you for the eighteen months. Arukana, thank you for the one hundred bits. Bubba Bob, thank you for the sixteen months. Figgly Puff, thank you for the two hundred bits. <laughs> Vortex, thank you for the 100 bits. Thornton 6000, thank you for the 17 months. Bubba Bob, thank you for the 500 bits. King Night Owl, thank you for the 16 months. Exo Demon, thank you for the two months of Prime. Lovely Lorelei, thank you for the 100 bits. Zephyrus 101, thank you for the 100 bits. Brian Merrill, thank you for the 50 bits. Zen Leader, thank you for the 500 bits. Kaze 3173, thank you for the 21 months. Aurelius, thank you for the eight months. Bulk551, thank you for the bit. Fantastic Callum, thank you for the five, 50 bits. Muscle Wizard, thank you for the 22 months. CD Regulus, thank you for the two months. Dr. Mighty, thank you for the 15 months. Quiet Riot, thank you for the 145 bits. Bubba Bob, thank you for the 500 bits. Oathbreaker John, thank you for the 100 bits. Super Choco Devil, thank you for the 14 months. Uh, Loma Day Paladin Chris, thank you for the eight months. Venmaru Karos Corwin, thank you for the 561 bits. And Spectrefall 99, thank you for the 1000 bits. Um, I think there was a bit drop that was eaten earlier, actually. There was one that was like, uh, 15,000 bits. Yeah, that, that sorry, got eaten. Get to that. Uh, yeah, I got eaten on the thing. I wonder if I can scroll up and find it. I, my thing's cut yeah. off. I can't get to it. Yeah. Whoever uh, that so was, thank you so much. Yeah, sorry we didn't get to you. If there's any way we can find that out so we can shout them out. Uh, I believe that was Spectrefall99 based on the top cheers. Uh, Spectrefall99 is at 17 on our... Yeah, uh, it might, it must, maybe it was Spectrefalls. Hmm. Well, it was it, it. It was not Dip and Bipples. He would be on this thing if it was him. <laughs> was it Dip and Bipples? With the it was not. Bucks? Don't you, point at Dip and Bipples just because you, his name is fucking, funny. You fucking japed yourself, Monty. Good job. I know. <laughs> fucking Dip and Bipples. All right. You guys ready to go? No, but yeah. let's go. <sighs> Connor. All right. Mm. Connor, you ready to go? Yeah. Bosco, are you ready to go? Adam Cole just died. Again? You didn't oh, you didn't see the end of it. <laughs> just wa watch Dynamite. Bosco. What happened? Attention, please. <laughs> <laughs> I need I need you here today. <laughs> Goodness gracious. All right. 
You get to go, Bosco? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> That's not what I want. That's what I want. Uh, someone is typing. If you're going to type, please mute. Uh, yeah, that was me. <laughs> Sorry. That was no yeah, that was trying to test to see if this was actually working. Alrighty. When last we left our heroes, Remy the Kenku fighter, Task the Cobalt Ranger, Panic the Tiefling Bard, and Greckles the Kenku Rogue, the party has burst forth along with a rebellion born of a prison break in the zealot lands of Periton. Now as the party rushes to the head temple of Orin, the Zenith Temple, the sun has shifted a darkened turn, and echoes of the past returned in the form of a dark eclipse. Now as the Unexpectables rush up the stairs to the massive temple, we return to a darkened sky and a darkened future. So, as you guys continue along with Solly and Pilchard in tow, and Quarion as well, you guys rush up the stairs, and immediately two spearmen charge towards your entire group of people. How well built do they look? Oh, these are like decorative guards, but they are going to defend. All right. Uh, I'm going to dash ahead. Okay. And um, clasping talons together in fashion, call it Mitsubishi and uh, cast color spray. Okay. Uh, boom. So let's see here. I roll 10d6. Go for it. Boom and boom. Those are not D6s. What am I doing? D10s. <laughs> Those are D10s. Excuse me. Hot damn. Let's try <laughs> this again, shall we? Okay. It may not 24. be enough. 24. It's just two guards, 50 feet cone. And they're blinded. And they don't make any saving throw. Just okay. It's just the health roll. All right. Yeah. yeah so as you let loose the color spray, you blast both of these guards in the face, and they immediately like slip on the stairs and crash to the ground on their sides as you guys rush past, and they're kind of clawing at their eyes, like ah, ah, as you guys run up the stairs, completely just in one shot, just nope, and then just kept running. Fuck Let's keep yeah. going. Good work. <sighs> this way through the front doors. As you guys reach the main kind of promenade, you actually remember this area. You remember this open sort of space as the space that Solly was trained in. Mm -hmm. It seems to be a training yard that is currently empty. Not only that, as you guys kind of run up the stairs, Solly kind of stops and she goes, there's no guards here. This way, the speaker's chambers are here. Um, can I roll a perception check to see if like there are dudes in hiding? Absolutely, go for it. Yahoo. Nice. 22. Surprisingly, no. Okay. And as that's you're, you're kind of you're kind of looking around, even Corian looks down and goes, it's not in the nature of parrots and soldiers to hide. It's against their, well, their worship, I suppose. As he's running next to you. He's not the most like constitution guy, but he's keeping, he's keeping yeah. pace. I, this feels like a trap. There's going to be at some point ahead of us that they're going to have a pincer maneuver. Well, let's watch our backs then, as you guys keep running. You make yourselves into the large kind of hallway. Interestingly, the right side of the chamber has like white, beautiful stone, and the left side now framing orange and kind of darkened orange twilight light are these massive glass curved walls. Most of this building is glass, interestingly enough, and is well-maintained and very clean. And as you guys continue running forward, passing these various massive doors, you see Solly kind of recounting. It's like, okay, the offices were there. Turn left, turn right, main worship chamber, and then the inner sanctum, and then beyond that, the reflection pool. Okay, this way. And she turns again. 
And there's a moment where she kind of pauses and looks at the sun and just kind of takes it in for a second as the sun at this point is just a ring of orange is all that kind of remains. It's just a black center and just a ring of orange. She kind of stops and she kind of turns without even look, looking at you, kind of looks at it and goes, was that what it was like for me when, when everything went wrong? Yeah, and eerily I, a lot. She turns towards you, Remy, and goes, your word, Knight, I need your word. For what exactly? What we talked about. Promise I me. Gave you, I gave you my word then, I give it to you now. Thank you. Let's keep moving. She keeps running. And as you guys kind of wind, it is like, it's a beautiful place. Like beautiful blue carpeting, like sunrooms everywhere, sculptures of these beautiful figures, as far as the eye can see. Eventually she brings us to a set of, she brings you to a set of double doors and she comes to open them and they are like locked. Like she kind of goes, <sighs> they're locked. We need to get through here. Is there a lock? Uh, no, it must be barred from the other side. Pilcher kind of rolls his shoulder and goes, well, I have a solution for that. Come on, all at once. And he kind of brings his head down and kind of brings his shoulder up. Is there anything like we could use as a battering ram in the general vicinity or is it just all glass walls? Uh, there are statues, but they're very big, so. Ah. Uh, yeah. Okay. All right, let's muscle up. Let's do it. All right. One, two, three! And I need everybody to make an athletics check for me. Uh, oh boy. Natural one, good. I slip and fall. 16 both ways. Nice. 15. Oh! Oh my god. So Corian got a natural, natural 20. Natural one. Oh. All right, so Corian got a natural 20. So that is two failures. That's four failures. And that is two successes, three successes, and then two more successes with Quarion. So that is a success, surprisingly. <laughs> as you guys kind of all as a group back up and then all at once, all of you just slam through the door. And as it, it actually bursts from the, the framing on the wall and both of the doors, actually one of them like smashes inwards and slides across the very smooth marble ground. And as you run in, you see standing at the end of this massive sort of church-like temple with the very beautiful marble um, pews and this very large uh, altar in the front. Standing, framing this altar on either side is Viantius Apostrophe and Regis Cade. Mm. Armored and armed. And they stand at ready. Viantius turns down and goes... Saliandris, it seems that you will not be put to sway. I'm sorry. And he pulls out his sword, and you see Sali kind of stand forward and go, No, you are not. And she pulls out Azra Sahard's blade. She turns yeah. towards Ragus Cade and goes, Ragus, please see reason. And there's a moment of pause as Viantius kind of shoots him a bit of a look, and he pulls out his sword as well. Insight on him. Go ahead. Yeah, I'd like to insight that as well. Likewise. 15? Ah, oh, nat one, never mind. 25. Oh, Fuck 25. yeah. You were saying? Remy, a bit of hesitation, but he his purpose is clear. He has chosen. Solly holds a sword and she turns towards him and goes, Go, hurry, stop the speaker. We don't have much time. Remy's gonna nod and start running. So are you gonna be okay? I will be okay. I'm not alone. And you see as Karian like just flipping a dagger in his hand and Pilcher to shing, also pulling out his sword. And they give you a nod as well. I am applying haste onto myself instantly. Okay, I would hold on off on that. You don't need to. You guys should probably okay. stick together because you would you okay. would zoom past everybody at that point, and that would be probably fair. Really fair you know what? Fair enough. Fair enough. Fair enough. Yeah. All right, you guys take off I, running. Yeah. Uh, As we. Has... Oh, go ahead. I, I've got a thing I want to do as we run, but go ahead. 
Um, as we walk past Ragus Cade, I'll just turn to him and I'll say, I didn't lie to you. We really do want to see the sun rise another day. And then I'll walk off. Okay. Um, as uh, Greckles runs past, he's actually going to hold out uh, his holy symbol and say, we all want to see the light again. You watch as Viantius is like lip and kind of nose curls in disgust. And as he goes, he aims, he aims a hand crossbow at you, but before he can let off a shot, a dagger hits it, and he kind of, <sighs> you are far worse, and points it towards Karion, and you hear Sally go, go, now, as she charges forward, and as you guys rush out of the room, you hear the sound of combat behind you, but you don't have time, as Sally is left behind, along with Karion and Pilchard and the Sword of Azra Sahar to fight back Regis Cade and Viantius Epistrophe in your stead. Let's and as you guys... Oh rush forward turning around it's a long narrow chamber that eventually leads to a very tall set of stairs that just goes up 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 and as you guys are kind of you know it's a lot of stairs you guys keep moving up the stairs kind of keeping pace and, and breathing heavily it opens up into like sort of this like rounded tops, um, almost like, you know, the rapture, like the, the tunnels that lead from different sections of rapture where it's like that big glass kind of dome. Mm, yeah. Semicircle. The, like a bi bathosphere. Yeah. As you guys continue running up, you see massive statues of, of what looks like to be solar framing the pathway that lies ahead. And as you guys bring yourselves up to a set of double doors, I assume you guys push them open. Yeah. Can, can you, we, mm, go ahead. Sorry. <laughs> as you guys push them open with both hands and step inside, you see standing up from a kneeling position and slowly turning towards you a figure you met in Alabast once before. An Azamar, unlike Sali, wearing a different set of ceremonial armor and turns towards you and with his voice says, It seems as though Orin has brought you to me as an act of providence. And you watch as Icarus rises and faces you, pulling out both of his swords as the doors slam behind you. You watch as bursting out from his back come two beautiful feathered wings that slowly begin to drip and melt. And standing before you is this. Oh, fuck. Oh, no! Let's go! Mm. Yeah. <laughs> got a little, uh, got a little ick there, bud. Yeah, everybody roll that shit for me. Let's fucking go. Sorry, I'm saving this image. Holy shit. 24. Hopefully uh, Jack can see it okay. Natural 20. Fuck 20 yeah. Win. It's a 15. Right. Task. Good initiatives, guys. Yeah. <laughs> All right. And unfortunately, as part of his lair action, Icarus does gain first in initiative due to this being his lair, obviously. But let us begin now as I bring you guys into combat. Oh, oh shit. <sighs> okay. All right. First thing that happens on Icarus's turn, and this is kind of the start of his combat, the four swords that he summons, they are tangible. So I'm just going to give you guys that information. So they are tangible objects. 
and they shoot into four spaces in the room, each one bearing a slightly different cue as it takes its place. And Icarus points towards the four of you and says, Come then, feel the sun. That is the start of his turn. Greckles, it is now your turn. Oh, jeez. Um... Oh, boy. Immediately. All right, Kai, we gotta fly. Understood. Understand. I really like this plan. <sighs> As the wings pop out. Yeah, you're not the only one. The highest uh, you can get in this space is 40 feet. It is a 40-foot ceiling. Gotcha. I'm more concerned about being able to move, like, uh, horizontally. Uh... Ooh. Bring his bring his talents together. Uh, uh, let's get that mirror image out. Okay. If you can dot me three times. Yes, sir. Okay. So let's see here. Free action, correct for for aspects. Yeah. Okay. So free action, main action, movement. Uh, let's go. Actually, no, I'm going to stay here. Um, I'm going to take Nick and chuck it at purple just to see what happens. Okay, go for it. Keop. Oh, okay. That misses. As you throw, the sword parries as if welded by a person. Mmm, okay. Mmm. That's okay. It was just a test shot to see what it does. Okay. Um, I'm actually going to get back behind Panic, and then I will call turn. Okay. That brings us to task. It is now your turn. All right. Free action speak. Big words from one who hides his skin within plate mail. And those words speak in stereo as he summons uh, Aos for haste. You got it, and you begin to double in speed. You were hasted. I get three actions this turn. Let's go. Uh, so, hmm, seeing purple uh, parry like it's a person, that kind of makes me feel a little weird. Uh, bonus action, Hunter's Mark on purple. You got it. Let's fucking go attack. 15. Alrighty, 15 does not hit. As you let loose the arrow, it bounces across as if it's parried once again. One of these has to hit, come on. I have three actions, one's gotta work. Love probability. Ooh. Oh my fucking God, that one. As you fire another arrow, this thing just drives the blade through and splits the arrow in half and it strikes in the wall behind it. Third attack. Oh my god. Oh my god. What god. the hell? Okay, that one. Okay, first one's miss. Second one is worse. It's a miss. So that three and a two, so both just miss. Neat. Uh, moving here. Okay. That brings us around to panic. It is now your turn. Okay. I guess I shouldn't waste any time with this. Um. Yeah, that's what I'll do. Um. Seeing as how we're going for the, um, we're going for the swords as well. I'm not sure what they do entirely. I'm going to cast Shatter. Okay. Uh, right between Icarus and this green sword up here. Okay. So they both need to make constitution saving throws. Got it. Uh, Icarus got a 22. Succeeds. 
and the sword. If it is a if it is a construct in any way, it has disadvantage. It does have disadvantage. It's good to know. Jesus, I rolled a natural twenty and a nineteen. Fuck. So nineteen. Uh, that succeeds. So they'll both be taking half. Uh, half of 11. That's five each. Got it. Um. Hmm. And then. Yeah, that seems like a good time for it. Uh, I'm going to the hellfire will billow in my body once more, shining through my scars, through my eyes, and through my mouth as I activate Mantle of Devilry. You got it. Uh, command Grovel on Icarus. All right, as you cast Command Grovel, nothing happens. He cannot be swayed. Shit. <laughs> Damn. Cool. That's my turn. Uh, I'll go uh, with my movement. I'll just kind of yeah, over to this corner here. All righty. That end your turn, Panic? Yeah. All right, Remy, it is now your turn. Okay, Remy is going to take a five-foot step to glare at Icarus, uh, and he will free action speak, and you will all hear him call out a spell that you have never heard him do before. No. <clears throat> and he, he will say, Clepeus Fide! And he is going to cast Shield of Faith. Okay. Fuck yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, and as he does that, he will glare at Icarus, They say you should never turn your back on someone you respect or fear. And Remy is going to full defense and turn his back. All right. So he will turn. turn around and face Greckles. And for the first time ever, he will not give his opponent the honor of staring at him. And he'll just hold out his hands. Uh, so they will be completely at a say. He'll have a shield in one and a, a sword in the other. And it's basically like if you can picture... Uh, like a T. Gotcha. Ah. Okay. Asserting dominance, I see. He's Y posing. <laughs> uh, Icarus says nothing. Okay. And is going to start his turn by invoking his swords. Yeah. So, I need Panic, Remy, and Greckles. I need you guys to make a dexterity saving throw for me. Oh, thank goodness. Okay. Uh, is each one targeting us individually? No, this is a big area of effect. Uh, soft 20. God. Soft 20. Eight. Okay, two successes and a failure. Right. Not, that's too many. That's not how many I said. Alrighty, those who succeeded, uh, you only take, uh, sorry, let me count here. That's a good sign. You take 19 points if you succeeded. And Ow. Remy, you're going to take uh, 38 points of radiant damage as the right. sword just spins in a burst and it just explodes as a cacophonous boom. It's all about that boom. I'm going to invoke rogue dodge and take nothing. Ow. Alrighty. Icarus. Uh, I need to maintain concentration on uh, fucking Mantle of Devilry, although it doesn't really matter at this point. I lose concentration. Icarus slowly strides towards you. Task. Hooray. You are a kobold. I'm sorry. Hmm. Actually, 
You're in the sky, right, Greckles? No, I'm still technically on the ground. He's gonna aim for you then, Greckles, three times, and he's gonna invoke his purple blade to attack Task instead. Okay. Okay. Uh, my AC is 18 because of haste. Good to know. Yeah, that's the better point. <laughs> Does a 35 hit you? Mm, no. <laughs> no. We'll start. We'll start with Icarus. Sorry, I got a lot of papers I gotta shift through right, right now. Fine. Yeah, 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 do you. All right, first attack on you, Greckles. Uh, that's actually terrible. That's a 13. I believe that nope. misses. That will miss. He swings once and you dodge nimbly. Second swing. Uh, much better. Uh, that is going to be a 28 to hit. Alrighty, let me roll my 20. Yep. That is six or higher. Woo! Okay, eats one of my duplicates. All right, one of the duplicates just shatters into place. As you watch, an ex like a raucous explosion of radiant energy just explode your duplicate, and you're like, oh, that almost happened to me, and he is going to swing one more time on you. Mm-hmm. That is going to be a 24 to hit. Okay, next one is, let's see here, eight. That's a nat oh. one, so I'm gonna take that hit. Um, you are gonna take this hit. So you take uh, eight points of slashing damage. Okay, let me get my calculator. Plus. plus 18 points of radiant damage. I will use my reaction to have that radiant damage. Okay, have down to nine. Cool. I think if if you, if that's all from one attack, don't you have all of it? We talked about that before, since it's different effects, I believe. Ah. Isn't it, Monty? Yeah, different damage sources. So one is the slashing damage and the other one is the extra damage. If that's it's, incorrect, I'm sure I'm going to get yelled at, and that's fine. Oh, I don't care. Oh, it's don't I, I basically imagine it like the slash down, then radiant explosion. Yeah, there's like a like a pause before it goes off. The sword is going to swing three times at you. Yeah. First attack. Uh, that is going You're to hasted, be... remember. Yep. That's actually a really shitty roll. That's going to be a 15 to hit. That misses. Alright, second swing bit better. Uh, that's going to be a 20... Yeah, uh, that hit. No, not, no, 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 sorry. 17 to hit. I apologize. That misses. Okay, that one misses what too. You? Your hasted movement lets you nimbly dodge the sword. Oh god. That's not on the board. Doesn't count. Uh, that's definitely gonna hit. That's a 24. <laughs> yeah, it hits. Alright, so you take uh, 13 points of slashing damage. Okay, what, hold on, let me get my calculator out because I actually realize that's probably going to be stupid important. Minus 13, okay. And 14 points of radiant damage as this thing slashes oh, into fucker. you as well. Cool. All right, let me roll concentration. You, do you roll concentration for this? Because it's, it's, it's your aspect that's casting it. Your aspect yeah. is casting it, so no. Oh, yeah, okay. You're good. Yeah, you're Sick. fine. Oh, I need to roll con for uh, my spell because I did take that hit. Mirror image isn't concentration either. That's right. I'm so yeah, sorry. Only, I'm so dumb. It, it's only why, why are we trying to sabotage ourselves? I yeah, don't guys. know, Zeno. <laughs> guys, they're hitting hard enough. I don't need y'all dropping your spells for no reason. <laughs> uh, let's see. We're just oh, trying right. to be honest. Let's see. Stop you asking have a, for more homework. You have a spell on you, Remy? Correct. All right. The... You watch as the blue sword in the top right corner, it like mm. spins around and takes the form of a staff for a brief moment, and it's gonna cast Dispel Magic on your spell. Counter spell. Okay. You counter spell it. The spell does not go off and you maintain your sanctuary or your, sorry, your, oh my God, my brain. Shield, shield of brain. One, Your shield of brain. faith, there we go. My brain. brain. <laughs> That ends Icarus's turn. That now brings us to 
Greckles, it is now your turn. All right. That was so, a really shitty round for me. I rolled really badly there. Good. Uh, we lived. We rolled bad too. All right. So let's see. I've got 60 feet to work with. So I'm going to go. I can make that diagonal movement, correct, Monty? You can fly over him, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So yeah, 10 going here. Range. And I'm flanking with Task. I'm going to bring down the Sunblade in just regular magical damage. Because this bastard's right. probably immune to Radiant. Hit! 22. 22? That hits for All six right. damage. Ooh. And you do get you, sneak attack. You get the sneak attack. You sure do. Get him. Get him. I'm going to open him up for Colossus Lair. Another 18 damage. 24 points of damage. You strike him in the back shoulder blades, and you watch as some of that, like, Icarus mycelium-like material, like, kind of scrapes across your skin and then vanishes for a brief moment as you kind of stagger backwards with your wings aloft. Ugh. And you can hear Kai's voice enter your mind. Okay, I see you wish for victory, and I know that is enough, but please do not touch that stuff. You got it. Um, I'm going to bring down another attack. Okay. He op. Let's go. Plus two. Uh, 19. Misses. As you <clears throat> go to strike again, he yeah, parries right. you back with his own sword. Cool. Uh, I'm going to take off 30 feet in the air. I got mobile. He can't do anything about it. Okay. Can you give me a little wing icon? Absolutely. Wing. All right, down the height. Wing. Sorry, that's me looking up something for my own benefit. Sorry. No, that's good. Wing. Wing. Wing right. resistance. <laughs> God damn it. I'm Nothing good. Fucking Nothing wind resistance. <laughs> okay, who's next? I'm so happy people know that reference. <laughs> uh. Ooh, okay, okay. All right, that brings us to task. It is now your turn. Uh... Does the sword want to take an attack of opportunity on me? It cannot. Mm. Oh, well, that's cool then. So can I move through ally spaces? You can, yes. Cool. I'm going to go right here. So that, so that was one, two, three. Oh, I have options here, and I don't know which one I want to do, but you know what? <laughs> Fuck it. Uh... I'm going to, you know, if he wants to take a fuck, actually, yeah, he's going to try and strike at me. So whatever. Does he want to take an attack of opportunity on me? Uh, he will absolutely do so. Yes. All right. The... He has disadvantage. Oh, oh, thank God. He has disadvantage. I just rolled a nat 20. <laughs> <laughs> That's going to be a 27 to hit instead of a natural oh, still, 20. Still fucking hits then. You take 11 points of slashing damage. All right. And 14 points of radiant damage as he hold just on. strikes you across your back uh, as you take off. Uh, so hold on. It was 14 minus 11. Uh, oh, God. The, it was first, 14. the first one was 11 and then 14. Yeah, so. All right, so. Cool. I'm... I'm so fucked already. Uh, all right, well, I'm here now. I may as well. Uh, pass Hunter's Mark onto Dickface. Got it. Dickers. Yeah, and can I roll something more than a one? That that'd be fucking super. There a we 26. go. Yeah. That hits. Here you go. Fucking Christ alive, finally. All right, has so... has damage, so Colossus Slayer will go off. Yep, and so will Hunter's Mark. So that's another seven, so... That's 15. 15. Points, of points of damage. Hold on, let me just do some math real fast. Mm -hmm. As you kind of get slashed up your back, it kind of, like, gives you momentum up into the ground. You kind of jump in the air and do, like, a front roll and then spin around and let loose an arrow, and it strikes right in the shoulder. And without even really reacting, he just grabs it, and you watch as it just turns to ash in his hands. Oh, that's cute. While well, he's grabbing that, another shot. That 22. Oh. 
Nine plus. Let's go. Four. Thirteen. 13. Yeah. All right. As he like grabs, he's like kind of gripping. You actually strike another arrow through his hand, and there's a moment where he like kind of curls his hand and looks at it, and he just kind of flexes the muscle, and it burns as well. Oh, that's cute. He has one more shot though. Let's go, Zito. Eighteen. You fire towards his head, and it just bounces off of his helmet. And for a second, he like kind of like his head kind of curls backwards, and then slowly reacts back into position slowly. Okay, well that's turn. Okay. That brings us around to Panic. It is now your turn. Okay. Uh, seeing as how these things don't react to movement. Yeah, I'm going to run up and over here next to Task. Okay. And I'll say, everyone get back! Uh, I will use a bonus action to give Mantle of Inspiration. Oh, excellent. Everyone Hooray. gets one temporary hit points and can okay. use the reactions to move if they want to. Cool. One, two, three, four. Uh, is this thing, sta can I stand on this? Yeah, it's an altar. It's like a flat kind of low altar. Okay, then I'm going to move over here. Yep. It's sacrilege, but does that really matter right now? <laughs> oh, fuck this guy. <laughs> Actually, I'm going to do... I'm still 30 feet in the air, too. So 30 feet up and 15 feet back. Task, as you end up in that position, yeah. your speed slows down. You're not stunned but your haste no longer is working. What? Oh, for fuck. Oh. Uh, oh. Well, that's a problem. Is Hunter's Mark still up? Hunter's Mark is still up, but the haste uh, is not working in that oh, space, it seems. Because hey. it's an aspect thing. Yep. Yeah. Something's fucking with our aspects. Over there specifically. Mm -hmm. Speaking of which, uh, I strike a chord on my guitar, and the the reality around Icarus begins to warp and wiggle, and crawling out from this tear in the dimensions is a Discord devil. Yeah. Okay, roll your D100. Let me grab the chart. Oh, please oh, don't be a tiny baby, please. man. I, I need... If ever there was a time to get a big boy... Yup. Also, that's like a demonic entity, so he's absolutely going to focus on it. Ooh. 87. Ooh. Ooh. Let's on, go. Hold on. Hold on. Let me look. That's a brass yeah. devil. I think it is, yeah. That's oh, a... Yeah. Ooh, boy. That is... What is CR? Wait, this is a CR8 creature. Holy shit. Hell it's yeah. Not, it's not a string devil, but it's the highest one I've ever gotten. I'll take it. Oh, this is the one that um, Scarlet's... Yeah, okay. This is perfect. Scarlet! Yeah! 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 yeah. <laughs> All right. As arriving on the scene, crawling out, and as the gate opens, you just hear this cacophonous noise. Crawling oh. out. <laughs> comes this demonic force. And you see Icarus's head turn, and not really surprised, but kind of turns and curls his head a little bit and grips his sword a little bit more carefully. So for this, the I want you to keep track of this for me, Connor, if you wouldn't mind. Uh -huh. yeah, uh, the brass devil. The token as well? Uh, yeah, I, you know what? I'm going to give you full control of this, honestly. Oh, now oh, is the time. Ha, ha. Ha, ha, to the funny <laughs> farm. <laughs> uh, this creature has an AC of 15 Okay. And has 104 hit points. Oh, oh, daddy. Thank you, boy. <laughs> but it will decide what it will do on its turn. But you can move it. But it's gonna if it's gonna air towards something, I'm gonna tell you it's gonna do that. I'm sorry. In in infernal, I'll point at Icarus and say he's infected with the same shit your master was. Do with that information what you will. As the horn devil turns, it's the brass devil turns. It goes. Burr, 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 burr. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Fuck yeah. Oh, some right. levity. Excellent. All right. Okay. What else are you doing for yourself, Panic? 
My turn. I have my action left. E. What to do? What to do? What to do? Um. really want to... Uh, uh, oh, I fucked something up. It's fine. That's not my own fault. It's okay. Continue. Uh, st okay. All right. No. Yeah. I'm, I'm doing this. Um, three. These don't count as creatures, do they? They are physical Perfect. creatures. Yes. Perfect. Yeah, uh, I will cast Bane then. <laughs> yeah, okay. yeah. Uh, I will cast Bane on Icarus, purple, and the red sword. Icarus, purple, and the red sword. All right, Icarus is going to. Uh, that is a was it charisma or wisdom? Charisma. Oh boy. Oh, it's charisma. The oh, hope. Oh, yeah. Uh, tw uh, soft twenty. Fuck. Yeah, he succeeds. That was close though. The mm -hmm. sword. Believe. Oh, yeah, that's right. charismatic is a sword. Uh, the sword gets a 30. <laughs> 30 29, 29, I apologize. Oh, okay. Well, okay. <laughs> and the last one gets a 16. He fails. Yes. Okay. That's the blue sword you said, right? The last one? The red one. Uh, I think he said oh, purple, one? red, and green. Right, purple, red, is... and Icarus. It is Bane's. Icarus and the other sword are unaffected by this spell. Honestly, that works. <laughs> what did you think was going to happen? Is that a fucking sword? Was a... <laughs> that wasn't even a natural 20, was it? No. Plus nine on his charisma saving throw for a fucking sword? <laughs> It's a very charismatic it's a, sword. Yeah, maybe Panic. you should up your game and be more charismatic, you know, like the swords. <laughs> the the sword, like, takes the stage when it goes back to Halifax. Dude, right, these swords right. are going to go on tour. Yeah, that's, that's my turn. That's my turn. That's all I got. All right. You heard of the four Remy. seasons? It's the four swords. Remy, it is now your turn. We're on a Excellent. Four sword adventure. Oh, fuck. Yeah. Uh, I'd like to five foot step and hit Mr. Red Boy. Okay, go for it. Uh, I will do so three times. And I will do so with my longsword. It's a 17 to hit. Just hits. Woo! Woo! That's 11 damage. Slashing. Nice. You slash into the sword and you actually carve away some of the radiant light on it. Good. Uh, I will do that again. 23. That hits. For seven damage. Okay. Very nice. And the third swing is a 17. So that'll hit. Just That's hits. seven damage. Yep. Very nice. You slash three times into the sword. It parries a couple of blows, but you just keep just spinning your blade towards it. Uh, question, is this thing floating in the air? It is, yes. Can it be knocked prone? No, it is immune to being prone. Okay, good. Got it. Um, I'm hovering. Okay, cool. I'm still going to shield bash it anyway. Okay. Uh, so that'll be an athletics check for him or acrobatics. I don't know how dexterous or strong it is. Uh, that's a 10 for Remy. Uh, that's going to be a 13 for it. Wow, I can't even bash. Okay, uh, then after that, Remy is going to five foot step back. Okay. And that will be turn, and he will turn to Greckles and in avian, so a language hopefully nobody else understands. We need to focus our attention on the other swords. Hit the red one. He nods back. All right, start of Icarus's turn. You watch as Icarus raises his hand, and you watch as the sword from his hand changes as a rotation occurs. These do not provoke opportunity attacks, as it does not provoke opportunity attacks for you guys. Okay. Whoop. Task, your haste returns to you. Woohoo! Ah! Oh, now I so Got it. As the red sword takes his position, and you watch as Icarus's blade glows more furiously. And he stares down the Discord Devil, and he's going to start with his... Actually, uh, that really helps you out, guy. Yeah. Yes. yes, it does. Oh. <laughs> That's actually... He, just did it... you, he did us a favor, because I messed up, but that fixed it. Unless it dies in one turn. 23 to hit the uh, Brass Devil. Yep. All right. 
This is go. gonna fucking hurt. Uh, first, the Brass Table Devil takes 10 points of slashing damage. All right, you're a beefy boy. Come on, hang in there. And that's gonna be... Sorry, one second. Seven. And the Brass Devil also takes... 29 points of damage, radiant, as it just, this raucous explosion just like echoes through the room. You all feel it in your lungs as boom, this large echoing boom occurs. Icarus is going to take his second attack at the Brass Devil. Uh, 24 to hit. Mm -hmm. uh, that's going to be 11 points of slashing damage. And... Oh my god, 43 points of radiant damage. <laughs> Last swing. Uh, 27 to hit. Mm -hmm. Oh, uh, six points of slashing damage. Mm -hmm. Oh, and 20, 23 points of radiant damage. It's dead. All oh right. Oh my god. That's what I thought. Shing, shing, shing it just explodes. But you did prevent that from happening to one of you guys. As he does I'm... that, you watch as his sword fades and is just sizzling as he slowly turns towards the rest of you. I'm betting you anything that that red sword gives him free smites. Yeah. All right. The sword's turn. Let's see. We'll start with blue. I'm sorry, Connor. You put him in a corner and he fought back. Put the baby in the corner. It's a hard fight. That is one of his turns that was eaten up, though. Mm -hmm. It is, yeah. And a big old ability. You know what? Yeah. Remy, make a wisdom saving throw for me. Me? Yeah. Uh, all right. 19. 19. You feel as the blue sword spins, you feel as your body begins to seize up, but you <coughs> manage to shake it off as the hold person does not take effect on you. Woo! Oh. All right. And then. Oh, it's this one again. Boop, boop, boop. It's going to float over to you. Hey, buddy. <laughs> Because it's not sharing the space, it's going to be less effective. Uh, natural one. <laughs> yeah. Oh, oh, severity. Oh, 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 severity. Okay, 15. It comes in and strikes at the altar and gets stuck in the stone, and it wastes the rest of its attack to get itself back out. Let's yeah, go. dude. That ends Icarus's turn. Uh, actually, he is going to move. He's going to move towards you, Remy. Okay. Just slowly. Mm. And that is going to end his turn. Uh, Greckles, it is now your turn. Okay, uh, let's see here. 30, 40, 55, I can hit it. Um, gonna throw Nick at purple. You got it. Keop. 20, both ways. That hits. Nine piercing, do I get sneak? Uh, you technically do, yes. Okay, cool. I'm there. Yeah, I, I just right next to it. I, I didn't know because the sword. And one more. 29 points of damage. Ooh. Yeah, that's a solid hit. As the thing is stuck in the stone, you take advantage of the situation and throw Todd and it smashes against it. It kind of spins and like clatters against the wall and then reconstitutes itself up proper. But oh. it definitely took some damage from that. All right, and then I'm going to uh, flip around and drop Nick into it. All right. Heop. 20 Good hit. Nice. Nine, nine damage. Nine points of damage, not bad. Good hit. Tell you what, I'm actually just going to move a little bit up here. Actually, screw it. I'm just going to move over here. Or here. <laughs> <laughs> I got a lot of movement to work with. It's fine. <laughs> so I'm, yeah, still 30 feet up. All right. That ends Go. your turn? Yep. All right, Task, it is now your turn. You know, 
fuck this guy. Task pulls, like, Task, like, reaches behind himself and gently pulls out a bear trap faced open at Icarus. Okay. Oh I boy. toss it up in the air and in the same vein, because I am hasted, I pull out the catapult scroll. <laughs> oh, oh my oh god. My <laughs> Go ahead and roll the catapult spell for me. I don't think I have it, though, is the problem. <sighs> All right, I'll look it up real fast. I got it. Yeah, you Hang can on. look it up in the compendium. Oh, my God. Uh, so, it is... Uh, uh, the object yes. flies... Not, yep. Yeah, dexterity saving throw. Good luck. Uh, that is a failure, but he is going to use a legendary resistance to succeed instead. I'm fucking... That's come no, on. No, no, that's honestly him burning that on this is good because when we start mm -hmm. casting on him, that's less than he can use. That All is right, great. Well, bonus action, pass Hunter's Mark onto purple. I'm going to, since it doesn't attack of opportunity, I'm just going to flavor that I jump along the brim of the sword and I fire at it. Absolutely go for it. I get two shots on this thing. Oh, God. Oh, oh, God. Oh, God. Oh. 20. Oh, so much for that bad luck. <laughs> Let's go, Zito. Oh, by the way, that's not my only bear trap. <laughs> yeah, I believe you. It's all good. Uh, so eight plus four. And now let me roll the Hunter's Mark and Colossus Slayer. Oh, five. You roll them twice as well. Roll them twice. Oh, you double right, 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 right. Crit. Six, yeah. four. So nice. ten... 15 plus 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. So 27. 27 points of damage. Not bad. The sword is still standing, but it's looking I, rather I, ragged at the I moment. I got one more shot. Go I'll for it. Finish it off, buddy. Let's go. I, I am applying sharpshooter. You got it. Ooh. Oh. 29. Oh. 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 That, yeah, that hit. 17 points of damage. Plus, hold up, hold up. Come on, buddy. Plus one. <laughs> it is That's fine. on its last ropes. Oh, but it is no. still standing. <laughs> Good shit, Zito. Yeah, yeah. <sighs> okay, that's it for me. All right, that brings us to panic. It is now your turn. Okay. I'm going to do something I probably should have done at the start of this. Um... Oh god, can I hit both of these? I can't. Shit. Although I probably should. Yeah, I probably should. Uh, alright. So potions are a bonus action, you said? Yep. Yes. Okay. Uh, I'm going to be bobbity boopy. Um... Uh, move up over he here next to Grackles. Uh, oh, hey. <laughs> I am going to... Yeah. I'm going to cast Shatter at the second level. Okay. Disadvantage um, on both of them. Con, right? Yep. Yep. Also, it's it's just the, it's just the purple one. 11. So that's a failure, I believe. Yep. Twelve thunder damage. You point your finger and it explodes into shards of light, and it it sucks itself back into Icarus. Okay. Uh, and I'm going to reach into my pouch. I'm going to pull out the potion of invulnerability, and I'm going to down that fucker. Fuck okay. yeah! Let's go, panic. For one minute, I'm resistant to all damage. You got it. Good shit. That's going to be my turn. All right, Remy, it is now your turn as Icarus stands before you. Remy is going to keep his shield in front of him, and he's going to put his sword away. And he's going to pull out a scroll and unfurl it in front of Icarus. Okay. And as he does, he is going to say... <clears throat> Athtar tried to break me, and he couldn't. And I see you don't mind your surroundings as well as he does. 
and I'm gonna cast Catapult on the same trap using Willow's spell. Oh! Oh, oh, a million oh, years yeah. ago. Yeah, what yeah, is yeah, yeah. the pull? That's a dexterity check. It is. Dexterity saving throw. Uh, dexterity saving throw. That's gonna be an eighteen. Uh, it would be Willow's uh, DC. DC. Oh, right. It's Willow's DC. Let me look that up real fast. Fucking sure. thank you, Bosco. I got you. And I, by the way, the Batman Begins pull of mining your surroundings. Just thought I'd throw that in there for good. Yeah, luck. dude. <laughs> Batman Begins. Hello, what is your saving throw for your spells? Uh, unfortunately, it's a fifteen for Willow. That's okay. I'll take so the sorry. narrative. I'll take the narrative. Uh, yeah, he like flare. backhands it. It kind of grips onto his gauntlet. And he just kind of slams it to the side, and it skitters across the ground. You did definitely catch him off guard for a moment. Okay. Uh, I will then bonus action use a potion. Okay. Uh, as we are about to go to war. Uh, so I will down the 44 plus 10 to zero. So hang on a second. You got it? Uh, yep. Let me, I can roll this real quick. So that's going to be, oh, I'll take nice. that. Ooh. Very so good. Nice. And so 23 comes back to me. Okay. Puts me right there. Um, and then that will be turn. That's everything I did. Bum, 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 bum. Yep, and then it. Remy will, again, pull out his sword narratively because I can't technically do it, but... <clears throat> All righty, that brings us around to... Oh, God, my fan is blowing my sheets around. I need those. <laughs> that brings us to the top of the tor turn order with Icarus. Icarus snaps his finger. Oh. Oh, dear. As this oh, moves this into place, <clears throat> your... AC goes down because your spell is turned off temporarily. Okay. Who's, okay. It's the blue yeah. sword. It blue is. Blue sword, yeah. Blue sword is the anti-magic one. So does that mean that spell's currently cast? Or does that mean you can't cast while it's near? You don't or is know. It both? Okay, cool. <laughs> Got it. We're going to find out. A mighty... Hmm. It's interesting too because they're moving in pattern. Like it's that's well, not that they have he needs, so he needs that there to get through my d ridiculous AC. So that's why he did that. However, it leaves red right there for you guys. Right. So you just this is what I'm designed to do. I just have to hang in there. No, you're fine. Never die All easy. Right. Come on, let's go. Come on, Remy. He's gonna take, take tweet three swings at you. Tweets. Oh. Twee. Twee swings at you. Uh, Nineteen. That'll miss. Okay. There we go. Uh, 26. Uh, w when I go to cast shield, does it go off? No. Okay. Well, then he hits. But that's how I needed to know. So that's good. Yeah. So spells also cannot be cast in the radius of this object, which is weird because it casts spells. So it's a cheater. What a dick. I mean, that's, <laughs> wow. to be fair, I didn't think we were playing by rules. We be, take be nine points. <laughs> You take nine points of okay. slashing damage. Got it. Thank you. And Tim. an additional eleven points of radiant damage. Right. And Close. for his third swing. Okay. Uh, twenty-four to hit. Uh, that will hit. Uh, that is going to be thirteen points of slashing damage. Okay. And. 18 points of radiant damage as he slams right. down into you three times. You managed to parry the first blow, but as you cast, try to cast shield on the second blow, he gets a heavy strike on your shoulder and then kicks you back and does another upward slash across the front of your armor. You hear the wrench of your armor break at this blade and he is just unrelenting as he keeps, even as you stagger back, he just steps forward and forward and forward. The swords go off as well. I need tasks. Greckles and panic to make dexterity saving throws for me as the red sword spins around and bursts again. I have advantage on this because of haste. There you go. Also, does it still affect me being 30 feet in the air? Yes, this thing okay. encompasses the entire space. Okay, I just want to make sure. 26. Nice. 17. 15, 15 and 17 are failures. Uh, still take half. Uh... Ooh. Sorry, I got a math here. Uh, task, you take 18 points of damage. All right. And the rest of you guys take 36 points of radiant damage as this concophous explosion goes off. Remember your resistance, Panic. 
Yep. It's, it's yeah. I'm sorry. How much? How much was that on save? Uh, on save is going to be 18. If okay. I'm getting my math right, because it's 36 cut in half, which I believe is 18. Right. So really, all of us took half from that. Yeah, all of us we took did. half. Yeah, then. pretty much. All right, purple sword. What are you? Kill do? that fucking sword. Purple. Purple's dead, isn't it? Purple, purple. is dead. Oh right, yeah, purple is no. I'm uh, sorry. Green. You're thinking of green. No, green. green hasn't oh, done anything, cool. which is odd. Green is lazy. <laughs> uh, or green is doing something that we don't see. It's a yeah. special trick that'll come out later. Great. Okay. What does it want to do? Hmm. Hmm. Hold on, I just gotta look something up real fast. Oh, fuck me, that's right, my speed is doubled. <laughs> there is. Yeah, yeah you can do the every, yeah. <laughs> Sorry, thank you for your patience, guys. I just gotta look something up. Yeah, you're good. Yeah. This is a weird fight. It is a layered fight. It sure is. <clears throat> Nice if I could just get. There it is, Jesus. Okay, you watch as the blue sword kind of spins again, and you watch as Icarus's blade takes an interesting form to it. It almost like kind of has this sort of like, you know, when you see like heat, like miasma, kind of like over a horizon. It's kind of like really hot, like things, a mirage. Sort of, yeah, yeah, like, like a, a mirage. You see that kind of billowing on his sword. All right, that ends the enemy's turn. That brings us to Greckles. It is now your turn. Oh, God almighty. Um. All right, so. Go get him. Yeah, Nick's going down on red. Chucking that sucker. Key up. Ah, that oh, I'm, right too. I'm right there. Yeah, and but that's only a plus two. It's still on that one. Yeah, it's still oh, on that fucker. One. Yeah. Uh, Okay. Sorry, sorry, sorry. That's all right. Ooh, I'm gonna roll again because I got a ten. That's like the middle, so. Ah, not the middle. All right, six. You just miss. Okay. You guys are getting lucky on these crit rolls. Yeah, I know. All right, Todd's going out because Nick's failing. Oh yeah. We're Come on, buddy. Lucky. Come on, flank him. I can't flank. I'm. Oh, I'm bad. oh you're in the air. Oh, that hits yeah. though. It doesn't matter. Hits. Now, if, if 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 I was attacking Icarus, yes, I would flank. But this, no. Okay, so Sneak eight. Sneak him. Sneak him. Boom, Sneak him. Boom. Sneaky. Another 24 Ooh. plus 8. That's 32. Oh my god. Yay. It's the only thing I'm good at. <laughs> yeah, but you're real good at it. All right. Hey, I'm Zenitsuing this really hard. I know what that means, maybe. No, I don't. What does that mean? Uh, you're a voice act. Never mind. Bosco, I'm disappointed. What? Uh, that's fine. Um. Doing that, let's see here. If I can do 20, yep. I'm going to move thusly. And I'll be turned. That was action, bonus action, movement. I'm still 30 Alrighty. feet up. Finish it. Icarus is going to take his legendary action, his first mm -hmm. legendary action. Mm hmm. As he's staring, like not breaking contact with you, Remy, he lifts yeah. up his hand and points it towards the red sword. And you watch Task and Panic as it shatters and <laughs> absorbs into him. Oh. Oh, great. Ah, oh, fuck. And you watch as he kind of grips his hand. There's a hole where Task arrow came in. He <laughs> heals up. Oh. Okay. But it's yep. gone. Theoretically, it's gone. Yeah, um, I have a feeling he's just going to summon it back. <laughs> uh, that'd be really, really overpowered. <laughs> but... Okay. Very, very cheesy. All right. All right so then, guys, just don't don't hit him until it's our time. All right, Task. It is now your turn. Okay. Um. <sighs> okay. So if my calculations are correct, if this rotates, I will still oh. have space if I move over fucking here. So I will have breathing room to possibly heal on my next turn. Bonus action on green. You got it. 
Uh, Hunter's Mark on green. And here we go. 29. 29 Ooh, hits let's green. Let's go! So, did it take damage? Nope, it is still full health. Okay, so this is the first time it takes damage. So, 9 plus 3, so 12. Not bad. All right, sharpshooter on this one. Come on, baby. Give me another 29. Come on! Oh, oh no, I never missed anyway, don't worry. On the last Inter one. Interestingly enough, as you shoot, you watch as the sword actually, like, it almost has like a sweeping motion, but you see a shield for a brief moment as you hit it, but it bounces off. Yeah. Oh. Interesting. I'm using a Green, lightning arrow, defensive. sharpshooter. You Let's go! It. Come on, baby. Yes, sir! Yeah. 21. Yeah. That, that hits. Yeah. So, nine, 19 plus... Four. Oh, that's all right. So 23. Lightning 23. damage. This lightning courses across and almost like scatters across the stone, burning the sides of the stone. It doesn't seem resistant or vulnerable to the lightning damage, so it takes it as it is. Neat. These are actually useful. <laughs> How chill. Huzzah. Hooray. Hopefully next round I can actually like tend to my fucking wounds. That's turn. All right. That brings us around to Panic. It is now your turn. Oh, fuck. Uh, so when, when the blue sword swept over to Remy, I noticed... Uh, I noticed that his sort of magical shield went away. You do, yeah. There's a shimmering on him, and it just kind of... And you notice too a task like he was like going hyperspeed, but then like just slowed down when he was near it. He also failed a Remy failed a spell. Like we would have heard him cast out and just not work. Yeah. I don't know if this would work. The only one way to find out though. Uh all right. I'm going to ha ha he he funny move <laughs> over here to this okay. thing. Is it within reach? It sure fucking is. Uh, my, I'm gonna, I am going to Galaxy Brain, uh, and I am going to cast Telekinesis. There it is. On okay. the blue sword. That is a strength that save, you a, said? That is a strength check. It is not strength a saving check. Throw. Got it. Oh, God, Jesus. Okay. It got a 21. Jesus Christ! Let's Come on, you can, can do it. That. Let's see if I can beat that. Come on! A 19. Oh! You, you pretend did. you're holding the hilt of the sword, but you feel as if someone is wrenching it away from your hands. That's fine. I'll just use my bonus action to down a potion. Oh, good, good try, though. No, that's fine. I'm still concentrating on it, so... I can try again. Uh, where are my potions? Where are my potions? Potions. I'll, I'll drink a Willow special, my last Willow special. Let's go. You're going to need it. Let's do it. 2d4 plus 8. Uh, it's going to be... Thir 13. 13. Wait. 13, yeah. Uh, okay. That's great, actually. That is fantastic. All right, that's me. All righty, that ends your turn. Mm -hmm. That brings us to Remy. It is now your turn as Icarus is looking down at you. First of all, I'm going to bonus action heal. So I'm going to burn another potion. This is, I think this is a Willow special. This is going to be 8D, uh, 8D4 plus 10. Okay. So, God damn. Yeah. I that's, see that's, that's a big one, yeah. Yep. That's the big boy. Uh, okay. I need to do Sorry. advanced. So D4, eight of these, please. That's not a potion, that's just whiskey. <laughs> and then plus, I believe it's plus 10. So I will heal 28, because that is with the plus 10. Very nice, cool. you, you. Okay. <sighs> Pours it through the eye slit of his fucking helmet. <laughs> yeah. Okay, three, 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 three. Okay, sorry, I'm just doing math in my head. No worries, no worries. Uh, all right, so that is that. Um, all right, I have to play this smart, so I apologize in advance, Monty. Uh, Remy is going to, as he's pulling out his sword and holding up his shield, he is, as he's staggering, pulling himself back up, 
standing in a defensive stance, he's going to full defense and call out to Aftar, <clears throat> or sorry, Icarus. You will learn that the Corbos never die easy. Finish the other swords! And he'll full defense in front of this man and stand stout. Okay. That ends your turn? That ends my turn. Top of the turn order. What does he want? Actually, these are dead, so these can go away. Sorry, one second. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Okay, just give me the fuck. <laughs> Google! <laughs> what? Do you need help looking something up? No! Okay. Don't, I don't. I'm having a great time. Shut up. Got it. Well, while she's doing that, uh, my, my fight music is brought to you by Liquid Tension Experiment, the song Acid Rain. <laughs> Shout out to Emberwick, who actually did our fight music that I got customly made for It's this. so oh. good. I'm really, it, I it, don't know what it sounds like, but I trust you. It's really good. Y'all should listen to it. Interesting. Okay. I, tr I trust you. I, I will listen right. to it in the pod. I want to listen to my own tracks right now. So it would have to swap. All right. Icarus raises his hand at the start of his turn. Oh, it fucking counterclockwises, damn it. Yeah, he can choose which direction. They have to be in order, but he can do left or right. Mm. Hey, at least I got my shield back. Scum, you lawn motherfucker. <laughs> you do, your <laughs> your shield nope. comes back. But yeah, notably, just... as the shield shows up, you notice that Icarus's armor begins to take a similar sort of form to mm. it as well. Mm. Uh-huh, I figured. Shield of Bath. First of shield. all, blue... Blue, actually, no, Blue Sword's not going to do that yet. Icarus is going to swing at you, Remy, three times. Okay. Because he's currently got a glowing sword that looks really scary and bad. Great! Disadvantage because you're being taken to dodge. Full action. defensive. Correct. Disadvantage. The first one is going to be a 15, which misses. Correct. Second swing. I am not fucking joking. I just got two natural 20s in a row. Jesus Christ! Okay. I'm taking a, I'm taking a picture. Just so you guys don't think I'm being bullshit. Uh, you know, <sighs> that that might need a little bit of confirmation, mine. Just a wee bit. <laughs> I rolled, yeah, yeah. I rolled twenty on the rainbow dice and a twenty on the fucking Dracona die. You know what? That sometimes it happens. There's nothing I can That's do. The rainbow dice for you. Yep. I'm I, so sorry. I just put it in general. No, yes, look, I I, I trust. I'm not even gonna look. I trust you. If if I didn't oh, trust you to do I that, I wouldn't be playing in this game. You're good. good All right, cool. there they are. Hey, hey, listen. You oh. gave confirmation. Thank you. Yep. I'm so happens. sorry. This, no, don't worry about it. I this listen. Is gonna, I know it's going to hurt. This is really going to fucking hurt. This is really going to fucking hurt. All right, let's start with just the regular damage. Okay. Uh, okay, you take 11 points of slashing damage with the crit. Okay, so that goes to here. Got it. And now comes the really bad damage. Yeah, this is going to hurt. I need you to roll low, though, so that'd be great. I need this. Google, stop being an asshole. God, she's reaching for the calculator. That's the easiest way to do this. Honestly, yeah. All right. Okay. 27 points of radiant damage. Okay. And the spell that was cast on him was a staggering smite. Oh. So I need you to make a wisdom saving throw. Okay. Oh boy. It's an 18. That's why this, that's why this still have, is so bad. Do you have if aspects? What? Do you have like the reroll? It wouldn't matter because it's two uh, 20s in a row. Nah, yeah. All right. All right. Uh, 18 uh, on the wisdom save. Okay. So you succeed on the wisdom save. Okay. Which that's is a good, good start. So uh, you take. Uh, so on a failed save, you would have had disadvantage on attack rolls and ability checks, and you could not take reactions. So you would have been oh, stunned for your entire turn. 
But instead, you're just going to take the damage, which okay. is 34 points of psychic oh, damage I'm directly still up. to your I'm head. I'm still up! Oh. Let's go, Remy! Oh, my God. So, can I, can I narratively explain how this goes down? Absolutely, go for it. Okay, so as Remy says he never dies easy, you will watch uh, Athtar's, or why do I keep saying that? Icarus' sword. Icarus, yeah. Burn, yeah, Icarus' sword burn with a unholy fire. And as he crashes it down and you watch the flames melt parts of the armor away, you watch Remy drop to the ground. And as you see him lying motionless, you slowly watch as he pulls himself back up onto his sword or onto his shield, holds out his sword and again in his helmet. Never die easy. He has one more attack on his <laughs> With disadvantage still. Disadvantage. Uh, 20, 26 to hit. Remy is going to throw up his hand. And he's going to cast shield. All right, and, it and will you miss. hope and shin the shield comes <sighs> up as this scathing blow <sighs> comes down. <sighs> he watches Icarus's head that's just looking down at you. You can see just the slightest glint of an eye looking down at you. Empty and hollow. <sighs> He turns his head towards the blue sword, which now spins oh and God. is going to cast Destructive Wave. Jesus! Oh, thank you. Okay, Six it's a level. fifth level. It's a, okay, then it's gone. It doesn't Oh, work. thank you. Uh, That's a lot that. of damage. Fuck that noise. <laughs> <laughs> fuck that noise. Um, also, I got hit for a crit, so I have to roll Constitution to keep it up. Uh, what was the uh, the damage? Uh, uh, the damage was thirty six. So you'd have to do half of that, which will be eighteen, I believe. Eighteen. So I need at least an eighteen. Con eighteen, yeah. Eighteen. Oh, eighteen. Let's, go. Let's fucking go. It dude. stays up. Can it hit Woo! Hit, 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 hit. All right. All right, and that's blue, green. All right, yeah. Oh, that was, you know what? Did you, look, you looked up Destruction Wave, didn't you? No, I know what it does. Okay. I know what it does as well. Uh, same. I looked at my spell slots. All righty. That ends Icarus's turn. Greckles, it is now your turn. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> All right. Kill the swords. That's the thing. Like, <sighs> I'll be making a weird executive decision. Um... Todd will be going to. Oh man. Um, no, Todd's going to green. Todd's going to green because I know it's hunter's marked. Okay. It's um, not unfortunately going to get sneak no. attack. You don't have an ally within five feet. Of oh, it, I know. I I know. Come on. Fifteen's probably oh. not going to hit. Bounces off as it takes the form of a shield again and bounces back the weapon. Greckles looks to Remy. Just beaten all to hell and, and looks at Icarus. He holds Todd back in his hand and chucks it at Icarus. Ooh, okay. Okay. If this hits him. Come on, baby. 27. Oh, yeah. Let's that go. Hits. With a great and angry fury of my friend being hurt. Oh, with another 25 points of damage. Oh, that's so good narratively. Fucking holy shit, bro. Let's go, Gaijin. Oh, God, I have to do math here. Hold on. Oh, that's so perfect. Oh, I want an animatic of that. That whole fucking sequence. Holy shit. I'm yeah, not done. Bro. I'm not done. Oh, let's go, bird bro. That is a scathing blow to Icarus. Cool. Is he look is he looking at me? He's head slowly kind of like it's almost like unnaturally, like similar to the guards of the void, kind of turns and twists up towards you and looks up towards you. Hold, holding the sunblade in his hand, radiating as much fear as he can, he screams out, holding his holy symbol, The light and the sun have left you! You are an abomination! If you want this, come and get it! Okay. And I am going to move yeah, over here. You got it. Cool. Alrighty, that brings us around to Task. It is now your turn. Task 
leans up against the wall. And I'm going to pop a... Do, 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 I just had it, I'm sorry. I'm going to pop a 44 plus 8. You got it. 8 plus 8, 16. Nice. 32, okay, so... Ba, 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 plus 16 equals... Okay, not, not terrible, but not the best. Uh, okay, uh, green is still hunter's marked, so attacking with sharpshooter. You got it. Come on, baby. 20. Misses. Oh, As 15. you hit it, 15. it forms into a shield, and it bounces across it. This thing seems to have a higher AC than the other swords. Fuck it, let's remember, do it again. Uh, uh, minus five to, to your attack rolls. 30, 25. Oh, that let's hits. go! That hits. So 18 plus. Oh my Six. god. That is clutch. Let's go, 18, baby. 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 27. 25, 26. 27? 27. Oh, 27. 27. Yeah, hold on. Because yeah, eight. That's 18 plus three is 21 plus six. Yeah, it's 27. One second. I gotta do weird math again. You guys keep making the health pools weird. And it's... By doing oh. damage, that thing that we're good at doing, you know. That's good. Yeah, no, it's good. It's good. <laughs> <sighs> It's still standing. It's but I'm not done yet. Blows. Oh. And oh, another one. Oh, baby. Yet. Another I one. I love you, kitchen gun. Damn. Damn. All right. That's not doing shit. Okay. That's not well, going to do anything. I'm so sorry. That's fine. You know what I'm going to fucking do? I'm going to do the I'm going to do the thing that rangers do best, be a coward. <laughs> Fair enough. And as you run over there, your haste spell returns to you, actually. So technically, you shouldn't have had that last attack anyway, but it missed, so it doesn't matter. But you shouldn't have had haste there. All right. Alrighty. That brings us around to... I don't know why you did that, because I just called him out. <laughs> yeah, why did you... <laughs> Panic, it is now your turn. Come on, boy. Okay, I need to get out of this goop. Get out get of out. the goop. Get out the goop. He's gonna fucking quadrant me if I do that shit, so I, I need to go down here. It's okay, guys, and I'm doing that thing, I turn to the comments, that they tell me I should stop being a coward and <laughs> join the group. Oh, you too, huh? Man. Oh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> I'm seriously banking on this working. It's almost like we're glass cannons or something, you know? I know, man. It's okay. It's not yeah, like they're I'm playing doing us. It. I'm doing it. I'm coming down here. What are you doing, Panic? Here. I'm coming down uh -huh. here with the rest of the group. Uh, my telekinesis comes back. Oh, that's right. And Athtar's joints are going to start locking as I cast telekinesis on him now. Okay. He needs to make a strength check. Really strong. 23. Come on, be the big brain. Oh, baby, you got it. Oh, oh. I'm using my inspiration. Oh, here you we got go. It. If three roll, go for it. Come on, baby. Just a couple Come more. On, Come, Come on. on Just a couple more, if. Nice. Oh. Oh, I'm so sorry. Fucking damn it. Uh. Bonus action healing word on Remy. You got it. Bless you. If you heal for nine. Okay, it's something. Okay. Yep, that's all I got. All right, that ends your turn, Panic. Mm -hmm. It is now Remy's turn. All right. Well, bonus action, I have to burn my other big kahuna, because... That hurt just a little bit. So I'm a, yeah, I'm just a wee bit. bit. Just, just a, a little bit. bit. Just a little bit. Thank God I got potions though. 84. Where'd my roller go? Uh, oh, there it is. You also Four. know that I'm stocked to the brim with potions. So Yeah, well, I'm going to need some soon. Okay, that's fine. That's uh, why I got the wings out. Let's see. Okay, that's huge. Ooh. Oh, big huge. Uh, all right. Um, 
Remy's gonna pick his ass back up. And he is gonna bang on his shield and motion with his sword for Icarus to bring it some more. And he's gonna full defense because I need All to right. not go down here. You hear a voice enter your mind. Yes. Perhaps it's time to invest. When you feel yourself surging with action, I shall help guide your sword. But if you miss, no refunds. Well, you know, if he die, it's fine. Hmm. <laughs> if Remy could nod in his head, he would. If you were to action surge, you get advantage on all your weapon strikes, essentially, is what. So Jesus. when I when so he when I good. action surge, or if, if I you, do it now. If like any time. So if you want to do like an attack action, oh. action surge, he'll give you all advantage. Holy Okay. Jesus, okay. that's six attacks. That is six attacks with advantage, yes. Oh, Tio. Oh, God. Tio is God. Tio is bored. <laughs> he's very <laughs> bored. <laughs> God. Can I tell that he's bored? Yep. He's pissed <laughs> all you're doing is defending. Okay. <sighs> You've begun to pick up on things with him. He will give you advantage if it's fun. <laughs> you have to be a stick in the mud on purpose for him to give you boons. That's amazing. <laughs> with his beak cracked and with his body somehow being held together, probably just by the armor he's wearing, in his head, he will respond to Tio. I was wondering when you were going to do something. <laughs> I thought the exact same thing. <laughs> oh, fucking dick. <laughs> well, I took my turn to full defense. Yep, that's fine. <sighs> All right, it is now Icarus's turn. What does he want to do? <sighs> hmm. See, he wants to get the anti-magic field, but that shifts the green one closer to you guys to kill it. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. So yeah. he's mm. a bit in a pickle at the moment. He sure mm. is. Mm, yes. <laughs> he's not going to move anything. He's going to keep the magic where it is, and he's going to keep the shield where it is. All right. Mm, cool. Three swings with disadvantage. Yep. His sword is not glowing. It still has that radiant glow, but it's not glowing. Uh, yeah, but it's that. better than a fucking smite. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, 19. Miss. Okay. Good. Uh, worse. Uh, 15. That'll miss. Let's I'm go, Remy! I'm gonna, Let's I'm gonna grab the rainbow go. dice. Go ahead. Uh, the rainbow dice fucking failed me. Uh, it actually might not have. 21. Miss. Let's go! All right, all three We're miss. <laughs> this I is all I'm built to do, Greco. <laughs> That's I fine! Don't, I, I don't want to say what I rolled, but, like, I rolled... Mostly beneath a 10, so that was really unfortunate for me. Jesus. But it was disadvantaged, so. He swings down once, and you kind of buckle the blow. He swings down another time, and you take the blow again, and he swings down a third time, and you just kind of stagger. Your talons scraping into the sharp stone and being pushed backwards, the ground scraping across with you. As each glancing uh, blow goes off, the blue sword... Let's see. Yeah, it's going to do that again. It's going to uh, cast Hold Person on you, Remy, so make a wisdom oh, saving throw for me. Gosh darn it, please. All right. One more time, baby. Come on. Oh, no. You have your reroll if you want to use it. I'm actually going to burn Indomitable and reroll that. Okay. Good. I forgot so, about Indomitable. Yeah. yeah so dude. I'm not going to burn. I'm not going to burn the other reroll because that's on anything. This is for saves. All right, Remy, one more time. Uh, 20! Yeah, yeah, go. 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 Holy shit. Oh. Holy shit. Uh, As you feel uh. your body, like, begin to seize up, you think of your mother and your brother and your mm -mm. sister. And not here. Not mm -mm. yet. And you uh, mm -mm. keep yourself solid. That ends the enemy's turn. Greckles, it is now your turn. All Get right. <laughs> like a shooting star is going to dive bomb down. I'm going to have 10 feet left to go with. Right behind, bring it down the sud blade and all the great irony. Ah, plus two. <gasps> 26. Oh, oh that was so close to a so angry money. Oh, it's okay. There's a crit on the it's other okay. side, but you still get sneak attack. Damage. Let's go, baby. You max damage, though. Yeah, you did max, max damage. 13. Get a big. Get plus a big one. another. Yes! 23. Yeah. So. 
36. Holy fucking shit. Yes, <laughs> sir. Yeah, that hurt him. That definitely hurt him. As he's like barreling down, as he lifts up, you actually like leap down and you drive the sunlight in the square of his back and he kind of shakes back and forth, the wings smearing and just all this gunk just slapping across the ground as he shakes you off and you kind of land on the ground and like kind of roll yourself away. And he reaches back and grabs the sunblade and wrenches it out and throws it at your feet. Pick yeah. it up and we're going to do it again. You got it. Let's go. Let's go. Yeah. Holy fuck. Let's go. 22. That 24. Hits. 24, that excuse me. Yeah. Eight or another eight. Let's go, Gaijin! He's looking rough. You see, as you pull out your blade, there's like a length of blood dripping off of it, and he kind of staggers and is kind of... <sighs> he's breathing, but he's not panting. It's weird. <sighs> it's very weird. I got 10 feet left. Gonna back up. And you're gonna hear Grekel scream, Remy, go all out! <laughs> Alrighty, at the end of your turn, Grekels, Icarus is going to use a legendary action, and you watch as the blue sword shatters. Okay. Uh oh. No more anti magic. Okay. 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 No more anti magic. He gets healed significantly, though. That's oh. fine. That's all fine. Right. That ends his legendary action. Task, it is now your turn. Uh, how does panic look? I'm fine. Okay. Uh, so then I'm going to, since I now can fucking run around at the speed of sound. Yep. 40, 40 God, feet. the situation. <laughs> uh, all right. Here we go. Since I still have that, uh... Task is going. You know what? No, not not just yet. It's not. It's not time just yet. I hope I get a chance to hit Icarus to do this. So, uh, I'm going to hit a uh, green sword uh, with. Let's see. Here we go. Eighteen. Unfortunately, you hit it and it bounces off. This thing has a high AC. Unfortunately. Okay. okay right. Fine. Here we go again. All right. Fine. I'll fucking do it again. Twenty. Oh, Twenty. 20, unfortunately, also misses. Oh, all right, I'm going okay. to shit. Right. I have three attacks. Here we go. There it is. That hits, that hits. And this thing was already hurt. Jesus. Jesus. It is. Yep, it is already hurt. All right, so 11 plus. Get that Colossus Slayer. 7, 8, 9. So 20. Ooh. Seven, eight, nine. Yeah, 20 points of damage. Not bad. It's looking pretty rough. But it's still standing. It still has energy to it. <sighs> That's unfortunately... Wait, no, I have a bonus action. I have a bonus action, so I'm going to drink another potion. Smart. You got it. Very smart. Uh, so I'm out of 44 plus 8, but I do have a 44 plus 4. I'm, I'm, feeling, I'm feeling confident in my decisions I've made thus far. Yeah. Yep. yep. 44 yeah. plus 4. Here we go. Wait, this is... We're just hanging in there. 9, so plus... That's 9 plus 4, so that's 13. Okay. That is turn. All right. So that brings us to panic. It is now your turn. I'm gonna fucking run up here. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, and I got 60 feet to work with, so I'm gonna try for Athtar again. Tell Icarus. It's Icarus. I did it it's too. Icarus, I did it too. You guys. I did it too. Jesus <laughs> Christ, you guys. <laughs> Who I'm cares? They're a... all assholes. I'm going to give Listen. him an extra attack every time you call him Aftar. Oh, come <laughs> the fuck God. on, Monty. I'm just, I'm just joking. I'm just joking. <laughs> what are you, Matt Mercer? <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> but right. it is Icarus. Come on. Aftar 2. <laughs> look, man, they all look the uh, same. Uh -huh. <laughs> So this, this this boss fight is is very fun though. Uh, it is very it is. very interesting mechanically. Uh, so he needs to make a strength check, not a saving throw. Yeah, I know that's what he's been doing. He's just he's very strong. Pinata, this boy. Uh oh god, that's gonna be a twenty four. All right, come on, I panic. Think I, need, I think I need a natural twenty to get that's this. A, look, you're due. Go for it, try. I mean, come on. Yeah. Uh, oh, that's right. Damn. Definitely. 
Uh, I won't do anything with my bonus action. That's gonna be my... Wait a minute. Um... Yeah, nothing with my bonus action. Okay. That ends your turn? Mm-hmm. All right, Remy, it is now your turn. <sighs> so, before I do anything... Uh... Uh, Remy is going to use Second Wind. Got so it. It'll be a D10 plus fighter level. That's, that'll be a bonus Ooh. action. Last Second Wind. Oh, oh. Oh. That's all right. So that's 13. But it's something. Um, and then Remy is going to basically turn his wrist with the sword in it, point it at Athtar, or at Icarus. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Uh, he's gonna <laughs> he's gonna point it at Icarus, and he is going to say, "My turn." Action surge. Let's go. You got Let's it. Let's go. All right. So these are all with advantage. You hear a voice in your head go, "Finally!" And you have advantage <laughs> on everything. <laughs> Six right. attacks. Jesus. Eighteen misses. Yup. Here we go. How many of these hit? This is gonna be interesting. 13. Uh, 25. Hits. Cool. So five points of slashing damage. You it's like Dark Souls, him. man. You're breaking his poise. Yeah, you really are. Yeah. Okay. Uh, Remy, the, so for the first three strikes, normally you see Remy with a longsword be very poised. He is almost banging him like he's bashing him with a baseball bat. Right, left, right, left. Just trying to carve up the armor. And he'll go he in manages, for three more strikes. He manages to parry the first two blows, but then an upper sweep just catches him off guard. He <sighs> slash up his side and cut part of the cloth on the side of his armor. Like ribbons just kind of fall to the ground, congealing with some of the goop that's on the ground. 25. That, that hits. <laughs> Five slashing. 19? 19 does not hit. He parries okay. it as you kind of bring down your sword. Let's go. One more. 16. Great. Misses, oh. unfortunately. I had advantage and I hit once. That's incredible. Okay. All right. That was turn. All right. And as we end wow. the turn order, if you guys would, wouldn't mind giving me like just a quick half second break, I'm just going to feed my cat because I don't think yeah, we can it's fine. I, I would like to use the restroom, actually. Yeah, restroom real quick, but we're not going to the break screen. So hurry back. All right. It. Pee -pee time. That was, I'm not going to lie. That was a little disappointing. Yeah. That was, I had like a whole thing prepared. If I got like a good roll, that was a little disappointing, but them's the breaks. All right. Hello guys. Welcome into the Bosco commercial break. Cause we don't have enough time for halftime. Thank you guys for tuning in. We really appreciate you. We're over a thousand people in here, so thank you for spending your Wednesday with us. Uh, that's very kind of all of you. We hope that you're enjoying the boss battle. And remember, Nova. Oh my goodness! Spectre fall with fifty thousand bits, no refunds. Yeah, Holy no kidding. Holy shit! Yeah. Thank you so much for that. Spectrefall going crazy with the bit bomb. I'm back. Welcome back, Zito. Blah. I grabbed a cookie too because I was a little bit hungry. I do have crackers from soup I had earlier today. I might just swallow one right now. <laughs> Saltines rule, man. Come on. That's true. This fight is so interesting so far. Mm. Yeah, tell me about it. Actually, we have fucking we have soup in the in the cabinet after this. I might just actually have a nice bowl of chicken noodle soup afterwards. Uh, I did not notice that Dick Butkus got verified. Why won't they verify me? Because <laughs> you're not Dick Butt. <laughs> You know, I can't argue with that. <laughs> Bernie Winter, thank you for the 50 bits. Kill that prick. It, we're working on it. I think 
Connor got up and Gaijin got think, up yeah. as well. Yeah. Come back. Uh, whose turn is it though? Because it was my turn. Isn't it the enemy? It's, it's enemy turn. It's at, it's at the top yeah. of turn order, so it's gonna be Icarus to start. Got it. You've never I'm not even Aaron mad Rogers. this motherfucker's healing himself. I'm actually kind of glad about it. I mean, it makes sense. It's that this yeah. is not meant to be an easy Yeah, yeah, fight. yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm back. You guys, if you guys remember when he came to Alabas, he had like way too many swords. Uh -huh. yep. That these are what this is why. No, oh, it, that, honestly, that was what? good. Good foreshadowing. <laughs> also, uh, thank you to Jack Kaiser for doing the artwork as well. Yeah, it was yeah, pretty that's yeah. for Jack piece of work. Mm -hmm. Thanks, thanks for again. thanks for giving us a fucking Dark Souls. He must Souls have had a lot of fun. Boss. I was gonna say he. I know how much he loves to draw his armored boys, so I'm sure he had a blast. I, doing I got that. the like the gauntlets messed up. That was my fault. But um, what do you mean? Oh, it's just it was a different design. So he had an original oh. design, and I didn't like it so much. It was very historically accurate and very pretty, but it didn't really fit Icarus. So I asked him to switch it back, and I felt a little bad about that. But Jack's pretty good about that stuff. You, <laughs> Jack is of the mind of you're paying me to draw something. I'm gonna draw it. No, he was very, he's like, he's like, send me references, let's do it. And I'm like, yeah, but he's a good egg. I like working Very good. Him. I mean, gorgeous. I'm Absolutely just showing the gorgeous. art on stream again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The feathers yeah, are really yeah. cool too, because it's like a, it's like a feathery wings, but they're oozing. It's like, it's a really cool, I see what he did. Too. Yeah. Like a lava lamp. It's like his wings are dying and thus the goop. And it's just, it, there's a lot of really good imagery there. Yeah, he's I leaving hate how a trail. Good I, I, he's leaving a trail behind him too when he walks. Yeah. <laughs> Ew, clean that up. All right, we all back? Mm, I think yeah. so. Here we go. All right, back into it. Let's go. Woo! All right, let's do it. Top of the turn order is Icarus's turn. What does Icarus want to do? Oh, I so tiny. forgot about that, but that's, you know what, that's fine. It doesn't matter. Anyway, uh -huh. all right. He is going to take two, like, he's going to take three swings at you, Remy. Okay. <sighs> oh, God. Terrible. 14 for the first Miss. roll. He swings down and you parry back the blow with your sword. Third swing. Okay, a bit better. 26. Uh, Remy's going to cast shield. Okay, and your shield blocks nope. it. Third attack. Uh, soft 20. Miss. All right. Huh. Fuck. That ends his turn. We live in, boys. His we swords in. are gone. I'm doing what I can. Just finish the sword. Oh, he actually put the sword in himself? No, it's still standing. No, it's still oh, there. okay, okay, okay. It's still standing. It seems as though whenever he absorbs a sword, it loses whatever area of effect that it has for him right. as a bonus. So. Um, yeah. Feels and like I, I know what this one's doing for him, which is why he needs it. Mm -hmm. But that will end his turn. Greckles, it is now your turn. Let's go. All right. All right. Game time. Bird's going to nut up. Let's go. You got to do it. Got to bird up. Like a, ah. like a, like a, like a crackle ah. in front of a target parking lot just swoops into that hot dog. <laughs> yeah! Yeah! <laughs> All right, let's go. First attack, Sunblade. Plus uh, two. Uh, let's uh, fucking oh, let's go! No! Yes, dude. Roll 20. He's going to get that hot dog. Oh! Oh! It's a big snack tonight, this, so that's 10 plus 12d6. Oh my god. Roll 12 slash roll 6. Yeah. Oh, Boom! 30, oh. 41 oh. points of damage. That hurt him. He is still standing. He kind of staggers as you just shunt back into his side. He like kicks you back to the ground and grabs the blade and tosses it to the ground and kind of grips his side as he looks at his hand and there's blood pooling out. Good. Do it again. Hit him again. Do it again. Do it again. Go. I was born in it. Oh, yeah. oh my oh, 22. God, dude. 22. <laughs> 22. Damage. damage again. 13 20, points of damage. 22 just hits. Let's go. 13 <laughs> points of damage. Max damage That's again. That's like bird bros. And he's staying there. He's oh, not fuck. running. You 
got it. I think I scared my neighbors. <laughs> you know what? They can live with it. Yeah. I can hear them from here, guys. <laughs> We've been what doing is... this. For, well, you guys have been doing this for four years. I think you're allowed to scream on this boss why fight. Is that, why is that nice man with the goatee screaming so much today? I'm so All angry because right. there's a nat 20 on the other side. That You already got your nat 20. We're good. You would have gotten oh, double sneak attack, though. That's the thing. So it would have been a little bit of a waste. Would you but... have on another natural 20? No, you no, do not. No, sneak attack only once procs turn. once a turn, yeah. 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 It's yeah. But it would still deal. be seven more damage. I was going to say, is, you that ends, would have. That ends that's, turn. That's, that ends your turn. At the end of Icarus's turn, he wasn't going to do this, but now he's going to have to. You watch as the green sword oh, good. disappears. Good job, nerd. What does and his shimmer is. disappear? His shimmer disappears. There it is. But his is wounds it? heal. His side <laughs> stitches up, but not as much as the last time he absorbed a sword. Yeah, dude. Yeah, because we destroyed that HP. sword. All right, boys. Watch as he takes in each sword, you watch as the wings <laughs> kind of stand upright as he gains a flying speed. Oh. oh. Uh, Let's well. go, bitch. Alrighty. Scumbobulous Michael is here. Oh, Pass, my. it is now your turn. Pass Hunter's Mark onto him. You got it? Here go. I fucking Yahoo go. 25. 25 yeah. hits. So nine plus Jeez. another nine, 18. Good. 18 points of damage. That's Second so shot. sad. Do you want to know something funny? That's exactly what he healed. <laughs> hey! Oh, no. He immediately lost You know it. what? I'm going to have Tass say something as a callback. Well, what do you know? It does bleed. Hey! 26 hits. Let's go! <laughs> all right, that's 11. That's you know right. what? I'm going to I'm going to try and big boy damage it. I'm going to sharpshooter this one. Oh boy. Come on. 22 Ooh. Oh fucker. 22 <laughs> hits. He lost no, his shield. No, he's sharpshooter. No, 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 he's I sharpshooter. Oh, right. it's minus he's 5. Oh. I'm so sorry. That is correct. No, it's fine. It's fine. But you're good. It was, you right. didn't lose a lot of damage. You're good. I, 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 I lost I lost out damage on an extra turn that I got from yeah. a magic spell. It's fine. Exactly. Panic. Whew. It's my turn. It, it sure is. is. Turn, yeah. Quick measure and shit. You have nothing. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm I'm a gonna he's gotta fail one of these times. I'm gonna try and research telekinesis on him. Come on. Got it. Uh, that's going to be a 21. Good grief. All right, that's a little better. Come on. Come on. You rolled a 20. 22! 22! Yeah! 22! Clutched! As, as, right. his wing, as his wings start to spread out, as he goes to flap them once, they go and they, freeze in mid-animation. It's, like, it's almost like a child grabbing onto a toy, just like crushes it down. You can see him. <sighs> Staggering and a bit. With the arcane energy crackling off of my fingertips, I lift him five feet into the air and I say, okay. You should have killed us in Alavast. Now we're going to save the world. And he is restrained. Oh, oh shit. Fuck okay. yeah. Oh, advantage to him. Hey, hey Greckles, you're ready mm -hmm. to do some work. Oh, you know it. <laughs> That's going to be my turn. All right. Holy shit, you guys. That brings this is like a total team battle. I love it. Remy, it is now your turn. Just to make sure, restrain means advantage to hit him within advantage, five feet, correct? Ad advantage, yes. Advantage. I like the way that sounds. So first thing I'm going to do, I'm running out of healing potion, so I'm going to burn a 44 plus four because I have Please one. Please do. Uh, 44 oh, You deserve it. Goodbye, swords. <laughs> Uh, that's a 16. That's not bad. That's nice. almost max that's for that. That's a little... All right, baby Willow. Thank you. So that's... Everyone gets advantage as a treat. <laughs> <laughs> right. Yes. And he has... I won't lie. I was scared for you guys for some of these... Some parts of this fight. I'm like... We're not done. Yeah. No, this we're is not like, done. We're not done. You're not... No, you're not done. It's not over. I'm, I'm waiting for phase two. 
right? Uh, uh, Remy, Remy is gonna, Remy is gonna smile at Greckles. <laughs> you, you won't see it, but you'll see the eye. Oh, I Just kind of, there's a look in the eye, and you know. And he's gonna fucking hit this motherfucker t three times. There we go. Um, here we go. Sixteen. <laughs> 16 unfortunately misses. Yep. Okay. Here we go. Advantage again. I've had nine attacks in a row with advantage. I've hit once. Come on, roll 20. Help me out. Come on, buddy. Oh, oh buddy. With advantage. I love it. We're good. I got one more. I'll take a soft hey! 20. There we go. There we go. Sir, it's I believe nine. you mean that's 25. That's 25, yeah. yeah. For nine points of damage. With that 18 of hit. Uh, yes. It yes, Aha. it would have. So that's oh, four more. That's why he stayed. So the, that's going to be The 18 20. plus two would have would have hit, sorry. The 16 oh, okay. doesn't hit. Okay. Yeah, no. Got it. His AC is 20, unfortunately. Mm, okay. I mean, no, that's good. That now. Yeah. Well, we figured because when he loses the shield, so we're good. Yeah. All right. All right, you got, you got a hit on him. I'll take it. Well, uh, yeah. Cool. Okay, and that it is was, Icarus's okay. turn. Yep. Um, I looked at restraint. He can still take actions. Correct. He can. But he can't move. He cannot move, but he doesn't need to move for what he's about to do. Okay. Oh, fucker. Uh, Ooh, he has to decide who he's not going to hit. He's going to aim for task because fuck task. <laughs> oh, all right, you're a cobalt. You're a cobalt. Uh, yeah, dude, but I'm to sorry. be fair, like you, you, you've got health. You're good. In the, in the words of Charlie, oh, all right, I'll go fuck myself. <laughs> you're welcome to watch. Just close the door on the way out. I need you guys to all make dexterity saving throws, except for I have uh, advantage crackles. on that. Oh, except, oh, oh okay, okay. Yeah. As above Icarus's head, a glowing ethereal Ooh. orb just cascades and explodes from his. How's a twenty-five deal you? That's a success. Panic, Remy. Yep. Nine. That is a failure. Eighteen. Eighteen is just a success. Ooh, let's go. So let me just start with the first part of this damage. Oh. Okay. <laughs> because you guys are gonna have to apply a bunch of stuff to this. Okay. So, first off, anyone who failed takes thirty-eight points of fire damage. Oh God. <laughs> Well, you have that. I know. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, I know, and it still hurts. Hey, hey, resistant. Monty. You're resistant to it, though, so keep that in mind. Hey, hey, Monty, if I you... use absorb elements, do I get double resistance? You do not. Resistance doesn't double stack. It only goes once. So. Okay, really? fair you enough. have it again? No, it doesn't, like, have it again. That would oh. be super broken. You could easily make a build that you just take no damage from okay. stuff. So. so it's 25 minus, it's half of 25? Uh, 19. it's half of 38, but you succeeded, so it's going to be half of that, which will be, I believe, 19. Divided by 2 And then two you have that 19. again. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. And then you have that again, so it goes down to, essentially, like, 9. 9. Yeah. Fuck yeah. Tass stands there, and he's still standing there. That was cute. Oh, he's not done yet. Everyone applied that damage. Uh, mm -hmm. One moment. One moment. One momento. Monty, I'm gonna. I'm gonna. Well, I'll let you finish. Okay, I'm good. Okay, you're good. <clears throat> Everybody else, you take. If you failed, you take 36 points of radiant damage. Yikes! If you succeed, you take half of that, which is going to be 18 points of radiant damage. Okay. 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 Ouch. Again, another Looney Tunes joke. Just like the, the match lighting <laughs> on the lady's foot. Ouch. <laughs> Notably, as he does that, you watch as four swords just kind of fall out of him. Just like, kang, 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 onto the ground, completely devoid of any life to them. What Did he hit us with like a blast of fire or what was it specifically? Yeah, it was like a huge explosion of, of radiant fire that just exploded out at a point. So as okay. he does that, Remy's going to throw up his shield and I'm going to burn my reaction with Shield Master to take no damage. I nice. Passed. Good shit. So he will watch Good the shit. flames hit the shield, and as Remy kind of knocks them away, he will be standing there as vigilant as ever, still up in his grill. Do you maintain... Is is Levit, uh, telekinesis a concentration spell, Panic? It is. All so right, you so you have to roll. roll. I yeah. need to make above a 10. Here we go. This is why you took it. It's a 12. I'm good. Let's go! All 
All right, he's still restrained. He's still restrained. All attacks on him have advantage. Do you, Let's do go! You, you didn't save, though, on the radiant damage. So yeah, you would have taken... Resistant. Well, but he was I'm he was resistant. resistant, so he took half damage. So He was... has the invulnerability potion. Oh, that's right! Oh, my God, I yeah. forgot about that. Okay, yeah, 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 you're good, you're good. I'm sorry, I was a little confused. I'm like, wait, it's what? Okay. <laughs> yeah. All right. Do I need like, a, little, a little thingy on my token? Good shit. No, you're yeah. good. I'll, I'll remember. Put a little thingy. A little thingy. I'll put a little shield on. Yeah, there you go. There, yeah, you, there you go. go. Hey. Yeah. All righty. That ends Icarus's turn. My heart. Greckles, it is now your turn. Thinking of Priest Irons and everyone that's been yep. put under the heel of this asshole group that's obviously corrupted brings down the Sunblade. Let's go. 24. 24 hits. Six go. plus. Six, six, sneak, baby. Boom. Be sneaky. Another Finish 16. Him. Finish 32, him. 32 points of damage. He's looking pretty rough. Cool. I'm going to do it again. Do it again. Worrying is Please sick. Please do it again. Thinky, thinking of Sully. Bring it down. Oh. Natural 20 yeah! for 20 yeah! damage. 20. Fuck yeah, dude. Go ahead. Roll your damage. Roll I did. Damage. It's 13. Okay, 13 points. He's still up. Oh, damn. <laughs> okay, okay. Come on, Task. He's holding his ground. Net whoever's next. You, you've been getting you can getting fucked enough by this, this area. Is, like this is in. this is you, baby. Okay, that ends your turn, Greckles. Yeah. Task, it is now your turn. Task doesn't grab an arrow. He grabs the glass dagger, puts it to Ooh. his forehead. Felim Vin. Zarnith Sai Itov. Grant me ice, Wait. my love. I am Sorry. using fucking draconic breath. I am using the draconic, uh, what is it? Give the chromatic. draconic, yeah, give the chromatic give the dragon chromatic. with ice. Nice. Okay. You apply ice to the dagger. And with that, my bow is now cased in ice. I look at him straight in the fucking dome. I pull the arrow back. Ghoul. Oh, yes, come yeah. on, please, roll 20! 23! Yes! Three. That hits, that hits. That's 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 ice damage. 12 ice damage, he's still up. Jesus, I'm not, on, Zito. motherfucker, I ain't done. Do it again. 19. 19. Oh, wait, no, advantage, because he's restrained. He's restrained. So, yeah, 23, yeah, 23, that 23. hits. Let's go! Mm. I get a task again. Ghoul. Five. So that's seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Come on. Silence rings out as the twang of Task's bow let loose, and the arrow strikes Icarus straight through his chest. Silence takes the hall as Icarus' head lolls forward and his helmet falls from his face. And behind it, you see a young man barely older than Solly. And he looks down, puts his hand to his center and lifts up his hand to look at the blood. And he stares down towards you, Remy, and says, I'm so sick of hurting. It's all I ever did. <laughs> and you watch as his body goes slack and motionless. And yet an exhale of peace and a small smile crawls across his face as he is finally free. Task holds the dagger to his head, looks down at it, and kisses the hilt. My last and ultimate kill because of you. Panic. As you stand there, you watch as the Icarus goo, almost like a trailing snake, snakes its way past between your legs and scurries underneath a crack in the wall right behind you. Oh, dear. The goop. It's going through one of the cracks in the wall. See um, if there's some kind of passage. I still have an 
Are we done with combat? Or we're done with combat? Yeah, you have killed okay. Icarus, the Azamar of Orin, and the Azamar of Periton. I shuffle for the mask. Okay. As you pull out Liza's mask, it is rattling, unlike it's ever rattled before. Uh, so where on the map did it exactly uh seep into? Right here. Over there. Uh, all right. Let's fucking roll an investigation check to see if there's a switch or something to get the wall down. You got it. I'm gonna take you guys back to the start screen. Okay. Oh, Remy's gonna grab guys. the helmet that came off his head. You got it. You can add Icarus's helmet to your list. As you feel around the wall, there is a secret door. It's easy to find because now as you guys are kind of standing in front of it, all of this goop is kind of kind of rolling around you and making its way, almost like fleeing, scurrying rats making its way hey. to some sort of magnetic pull. Hey, hey, Monty. Mm -hmm. Before we move on, can I have Task cast at third level fucking cure wounds? Absolutely. Because God. <laughs> Also, Remy, you're going to feel Greckles put into your hands uh, 2D, uh, let's see, 2D4 plus 8 healing potions. 2D4 so plus 8? Two 2D4 plus 8 healing potions. Two Got of it. them. So that is do, 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 spell, bu, 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 my spellcasting modifier on my wisdom, which my wisdom is 2, so that's 3D... 3D, uh, 3D8 plus, uh, 6. Uh, you said it was 44 or 2D4? Uh, 44 2D. plus 8. Got it. Perfect. Eight, All right. Nine, oh, no, I'm sorry. 2D4 plus 8. 2D4. Got it. Cool. And I got 14 HP back. That's what I thought. All right. And you know, and you know what? For, for one more bit of, like, extra little bit of security health... I'm using the bomb one more time. I have one more thing after that. You got it. Cool. So <sighs> the bomb for me was... Uh-oh. Why is roll 20 not allowing me to look at my items? Uh-oh. Mm. Uh-oh. One moment. Do-do-do-do. Please. Please grant me the ability to actually scroll down my character sheet. Thank you're you. Letting us, okay. You're letting us drink potions right now, Monty? Yeah, absolutely. Okay. I'm going to drink one of the ones Gaijin just gave me. I'm I'm fine. I'm 20, fine too. 28. I'm only twenty down. And uh two D eight plus eight. This is plus eight. So four plus eight is twelve. Eight, Actually nine, I could 10, I 11, could drink 12. one of mine. Why not? I'll roll. Money, how how far away did we have to travel away from um the fight going on with uh I will I will say this, the door behind you is closed permanently you cannot go back gotcha okay mm -hmm. no way to you, go but forward yeah you, you know uh, what <clears throat> yeah if we're gonna just cast potions i'm gonna do it <laughs> fellas i didn't want to bring this up but who knows what we're going to walk into there i am tapped i've got maybe like two spells left in me at most and we have a corpse right here. And I reach for one of the scrolls that I got from Mel. Should I? What exactly are you trying to do? We barely survived that. And we don't know what the speaker is going to do or what it's capable of. Perhaps we could give Icarus some measure of revenge. Panic, panic. You cannot do so at the cost of his peace. Peace. Come on, buddy, we can do this. I'll gently lower Icarus's body to the ground. I still had it in my telekinetic grip. Mm -hmm. And I'll grab his arms and I'll 
fold them over onto his chest, sort of covering the wound from the arrow. And I'll lower his eyelids if they were open. He wasn't a child, but he was much younger than you thought. Maybe a couple years older than Sully. Let's do this then. And I'll put away the scroll. Let's go. I'm I'm going to use one more level two spell slot for cure for cure wounds. You got it. So two D eight. I guess I might as well use the other potion then. Yeah, I'm 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 getting myself to full because this is gonna be harrowing. I was gonna I'm, say I'm, there's no point. I'm good on health. So if anybody needs to, if anybody wants to hold on to their potions. Oh, that's good. fucking bad. <laughs> I'm gonna hold I'll take that. That's five plus. Yeah. Five plus eight. It's all right. Thirteen. Thirteen. All right. You know, at at this point, I'll hold on to whatever else I have because this is all. How many do you have, uh, Connor? How many do you have on you? How many potions? Yeah. Just the one now. Oh yeah, hang on to it because if you I go down, have, yeah, just a greater. <sighs> all right. Let me burn Let's do this. Yep. Okay. You guys push on the secret door and it <laughs> opens up. And as you guys enter inside, it is a another hallway that actually has a window on its right side as well. And as you guys guys proceed forward, your footsteps echoing across the hallway, you hear as the walls on the left side just begin to bleed out this ooze it avoids you like oil and water but as you proceed forward you get a great sense of unease this might be a little bit loud but i'm going to turn it down a little bit and turn it up if necessary so just let me know okay uh okay As you guys proceed forward through the hallway, the goo begins to crawl up the sides of the glass, making it pitch dark. Only a faint light creeping through as you move forward. With each step you take, the darkness kind of shifts away from your foot and then recombines as the moment you lift it as you proceed forward. No. Not only lies now is rattling, but each of your aspects as well as you walk forward. Come on, guys. We made it this far. Don't lose your nerve. My hunt's not done. As you make your way forward, a door kind of melts into view and it (laughs) opens up and it is just a flood of this mycelium dust-like ichor that just pulls over and avoids you. It almost goes around your bodies as it flows into the hallway. And as you walk in, you see a form just standing. Beautiful, intricate white and gold robes and a hood of their head. And the moment they turn their face towards you, it's just a faucet dispensing this stuff in the room. And it crawls along the walls. It blocks out the light. It takes away everything. It takes away the door. It takes away panic. Beside you, Task, he suddenly vanishes. Remy, Greckles is out of view. The light is gone. Your friends are gone and you are all alone, completely and utterly alone, set adrift in darkness, in nothing, in the end. And all that reaches you is an irreparable wrath that shreds you from the inside like a scream trying to reach to your skull down your spine and into your very being as you just float in an empty void of nothing (laughs) 
but you all hear a voice. One that actually has words. I'm scared. Scared. I'm scared. Scared. I'm scared. Scared. As Liza's voice breaks through the silence. I can't do this. This. I can't do this. This. Not again. I can't. Not again. I can't. I'm scared. Scared. I'm scared. Scared. I'm scared. Scared. I can't. Can't. It cannot happen this way. This way. Do I have the mask? You can't even move. You don't even see the rest of your body. Oh. You're just floating. Can we you speak? Can... You can speak still, yes. What do you say? All um, of us? Uh, I, I think we should all take turns, because I feel like we're all going to have to say something. Mm -hmm. What is this alone nonsense? We are here with you, just as you have been for us. To not think of the strives we have made, the paths we've walked, this whole ordeal we've been through together. Are we nothing to you? We're here beside you. The paths we've walked, walked, beside, beside. Who would like to speak next? I will speak next. Like a parent to us, you showed us our folly. You showed us how to grow and change, and we've all grown and changed. We will not abandon you. You will not abandon us. We are in this together. All of us are in this together. We will not go quietly into the night. We will not fade from existence and our light will not peter out in this darkness. We're You'll with you, on. Lies. With me. me. Carry on. Carry on. Who would like to speak next? Go for it, Connor. You know lies. Lies! You showed me that I could love this world, that I could love others and be loved in return. You are not, and never have been alone. And neither have we. We've lost so much, but we've gained so much more. And we're not gonna lose all we've gained. Now, we won't become as dust, drifting, directionless divine. We're here, and we're here with you. And we need to see this through to the end, together. You feel almost a scream go through you again, as if something is arguing with your statements. But then you feel something cold on your face. Panic. You feel white porcelain on your face. And a voice speak. Thus drifting directionless divine. As you feel catharsis summon in your hand. Greckles. You hear a voice enter your mind as you feel cold porcelain on your face. I do know that beyond this place, there is no, no more left for me, not a single date. But we must end this before it's too late. As you feel the wings on your back <laughs> open up. I, 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 I would like to see this through as well, Task. What say you? Let, 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 let's stick it to these damned gods for once, huh? Hmm. You feel sh the bow and a white porcelain mask land on your face. Remy. The black card. Ha! <laughs> the black card. So be it. No refunds. As you feel a cold porcelain mask on your face and the shoulder pauldron form as all of you feel a ground at your feet. <laughs> and you see lies. In a humanoid form, with a robe. About your guys' height, with the mask. 
standing, trembling, next to you. Help me. Can we move? You can, yes. Immediately, Greckles goes over, puts one arm around his back, one arm out for, for him to grasp his talon to lift him up. He takes your hand and stands up. And he reaches over to whoever would like to take his other hand. I will. You need only ask, and I grab it. And as he takes a trepidatious step forward into the darkness, into this unknown land, that is where we're going to end this session for tonight. Oh, oh baby! Oh, God! Shout out to Lorian Ross, who did this song, by the way. Oh my yeah, god. Dude, it's a remix of the fucking Unexpectable Sleep. I know, and it's, yeah. Money, mm -hmm. I'm getting such, like, ele like Final Fantasy 11, or no, nine flashbacks. Mm-hmm. Yeah, bro. Uh, man, bye, Austin. Bye, Austin. Bye, Austin. Bye, Austin. But that being said, Next week is not going to be the Unexpectables, but it is going to be the Unexpectables. Because off in the southwestern reaches of Alavast currently stands a war party. Seika, new emperor of the Fire Plains, and three allies are on their path to retake Alavast. Ladies and gentlemen, we are going to have a one shot for each guest star and one off group that we've had that we've managed to organize up until the final episode of The Unexpectables. Starting first is going to be Seika, and then after that is going to be the Mercs. So we hope you guys enjoy when next week comes around because there's not just a fight going on in Periton, there is currently a fight in Alabas to reclaim and stop the United Clergy who is there from taking over the entire country. Thank you guys so much for, for you know, yeah, playing Holy. today. Yo, Holy it was crap. it was so good. <laughs> we are in Endgame, yes, and we hope you guys stick with us until the end. I'm nervous, I'm excited, and I think it's going to be a good time but next week is going to be Seika's group uh Seika's group includes just so people know who's going to be involved uh Seika's group in includes uh the Willy Boo Colonel Sheru and Zan a friend of uh Mark's so hell yeah 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 it's going to be very exciting um their mission is very interesting every single group has a mission they need to do um, of varying different importances, and if they succeed or fail at these, it will affect things. So that's going to be really, really interesting. But <sighs> yeah, no, they're, keep they're, your guys' eyes peeled for that. It's going to be a big, big thing. So there are uh, there are folks in chat who are asking who Willie is. Uh, I I know him as the guy who made the clones on DMs Guild. But Gaijin, you want to fill that in? Yeah. So. Uh, Distortion Devil and myself, we play every Thursday with uh, him, uh, Cheru, and uh, Eric, who's a very interesting fellow, um, for uh, Shadows We Cast. Uh, it's a great group. Willie's a great DM. He's very, very creative. Uh, mm -hmm. Frogs yeah. riding spurs, man. And, and the, Southern this man, we're, this we're man really is a crazy home brewer like me <laughs> we're, yeah we're currently running through a a very much very very homebrewed version uh if it's, it's full of homebrew but it is essentially storm king's thunder mm -hmm. uh and it's been uh very very cool to be able to play with him mm -hmm. and i you'll be able if you're not familiar you can see him in action here soon i'm super excited i've never seen him actually play i've only heard stories <laughs> <laughs> I, I gave an outline. I'm like, okay, you know, no joke characters. Keep it kind of serious, but I'm excited. The group's going to be definitely quite interesting. Um, quite a cast of characters, and I'm very excited to have uh, Mark back for a one-shot. That's going to be really, really fun as well. Yeah, yeah. 
And then, yeah, we got the Mercs. The Mercs have a new recruit as well. That's going to be really exciting because mm -hmm. Remy's not going to be there. So, you know, that's going to be pretty, pretty hoo-hoo funny. We get to be in the peanut gallery this time around. You yeah, do. Yeah, you guys get to watch. We're on the bench for a while. You are, yeah. Boy, so, howdy. Definitely uh, keep your guys' eyes peeled for that. There'll be announcements for that. And I hope this was kind of a risk, but I'm like, I feel like I want all the guest stars to have their last kind of hurrah of the final kind of part of the story. And leading up to the the final, final, like, like whatever is going to happen. So, yeah. Man, dude. <laughs> My guts churning in the best way possible. I know. Oh my god. How do you think I feel right now? <laughs> uh, guys, guest stars, you better win or we'll get the bad ending. Please. Yeah. <laughs> don't don't fuck this for us. <laughs> this is not filler. All of this, Every all of this is canonical. Nothing about it is filler. This is all all this is what's happening while you guys are bas basically fought Icarus is basically all this shit is happening um, around the same yeah, time. We're Money, I, I'm seeing mm -hmm. some people in chat asking if it's just gonna be the Mercs and then Seika's group. Oh no. Um I again I don't wanna promise everything out, out the gate, but the, the best way to put it is but wait, there's more. There's yeah. more. Well, we're not so done far, yet. I wish I could find my list because I do have a list of all the games we have prepared. Um, we, we, but we've, we, we've kind of been sitting on this for a while, haven't we? We have, yes. So we have Seika, the Mercs, Limalicious, Rat, Obby, Digsby, and Zenrio in that order. It's good so stuff. That's, that's what we're going to have. So we're going to have Seika and the Mercs to start. And then after that, it's going to be Limes and Rat. So we we'll start getting those groups organized as well. That's why I'm busy, and that's also why I haven't been streaming so much, because I've had to, like, organize things. Because this is huge, man! It's, uh, it's so kind of a big, big undertaking, yes. Oh, my God, guys. Oh, Bro, my this God. was great, Monty. Oh, this, man. That boss fight yeah. fucking ruled. <laughs> thank, thank Brett Ultimus. I played in his game, and I really liked how he did some of his boss fights. I didn't like everything about it, but there was some stuff that I really enjoyed, and so I tried to kind of take a little bit of inspiration from him. So mm -hmm. credit where credit's due. Brett Ultimus was, is a great DM as well. He's very he's much more technical in terms of, like, combat than I am. Um, like, he does a crazy homebrew con uh, combat, but I tried to kind of mix that a little bit, because I'm like, I really want to have, like, a more sort of, like, you guys have to pick and choose how to be more effective and stuff like that. Because I was going to wait for you guys to either, like, completely go for Icarus or go for just the swords, but you guys kind of did a blend of both, which was really interesting and mm -hmm. kind of worked out really well. But I, um, I, I felt yeah. like it was a good idea to, like, have at least most of us go for the sword and have someone peck at him, so we had to prioritize order. Right. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I'm and glad you guys got rid of that red. That red sword was the meanest sword. That that they actually all had names. Each, each so had like... so was I right on my on my guess for that one? So hold on, the green sword, which was the sword of sanctuary. Um, the sword of sanctuary has it has an individual ability and then it has a unique ability. So sword of sanctuary, uh, it has an AC of twenty two, unlike the other swords. Fuck. Uh, yeah. And while whilst Icarus stands within the space of the sword of sanctuary, he gains a plus two to his AC. Hmm. The spell saber, uh, it casts a spell on its turn from Icarus. Essentially, Icarus had some spell slots, uh, but it casts a spell on its turn. And then any spell cast within the spell saber's radius or concentrated on within the radius automatically fails. Uh, and in brackets, it creates an, an anti magic field in its wake. Icarus is not affected by this anti magic field. Mm -hmm. The Dirk of Destruction, which was the fuck you, uh, was the red one. Uh, its space explodes. Creatures must make a DC 18 saving throw or take 10 D6 radiant damage. Fuck. Uh, oh, and when, when Icarus is in the space, Icarus gains an additional 3D8 to his radiant damage on his oh attack my rolls. Oh god. Yeah, the red one's scary. And then purple, uh, the, this one I fucked up actually quite badly, so this was my bad, but, uh, on its thing, anybody who's in the space with it, it gets a three attacks on one creature within its space, but if Icarus is standing in its space, he gets a free action surge. Oh my god! Oh. Christ so I, alive. So I fucked that one up a little bit, but oh well. That's you know. just a fucking oofer right there. Oh. Yeah. So, very, very, uh, very, very scary, scary, scary sword. Very, very frightening me. Galileo. 
I'm not playing music because it feels like not the time to play happy no. music. At yeah, the no, 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 not at all. Either. Yeah, no. I uh, and thank you again to Lori and Ross for doing that music as well. They did that like super fast, which was really impressive. So it's crazy. Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. God. God, it's 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 it's, it's going to be cool, but also kind of like bittersweet for us for the for the main cast. We're just sitting here like, man, we're going to be out for a while. Yep. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, but boy, howdy, when we come back, though. Yeah, dude. <sighs> so good job, Monty, first of all. Hell yeah. Thank you. That was that was quite a fight that 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 yeah, yeah. fight. I was like, oh, my God. It, it, it seemed a little on the scary side, but once we started getting a groove into the pattern, we were like, OK, no, this mm -hmm. this this feels doable. But yeah. God, I, so I, I much used... damage. I use oh yeah, everything. I'm I'm actually okay. I, I know this is gonna sound egotistical as fuck, but I'm kind of a stupefied, but also so happy that Tass got fucking the kill on that yeah. on that fluff roll. Mm -hmm. Um, like I I fucking dramaed the shit out of that attack, and it actually worked, and I'm so happy. I I personally wanted Remy to kill him just yeah. for the, the the scene that occurred afterwards, but it didn't matter. I'm like it, it'll work no matter what. But Remy that was fucking. Tanks. Remy, no, MG. Oh I, yeah. I am honestly shocked none of us went down. That yeah, fight. I was shocked too. I was like, "Holy shit!" Like, because like when I was I, looking at his damage, I'm like, "This is a scary motherfucker." Like, Icarus is yeah. by far the strongest single enemy you face also, in the entire also, game. Also, I I shit my pants when he did the uh, when they did the destructive wave because oh, the yeah. only the oh. only slot I had left for counter spell was my sixth level. And I was like, fuck, there goes Mass Cure Wounds. Mm. Bro, I think you made the right choice. Yeah, you I, did. I certainly fucking did. So let's explain what uh, Destructive Wave it's, does, please. shall we? It's, it's, what is it? Is it 2d8 Thunder and then 2d8 uh, Oh, not the even the close. Ground. Yeah, not you even strike close. the ground, creating a burst of divine energy that ripples outwards from you. Each creature you choose within 30 feet must succeed on a constitution saving throw or take 5d6 Thunder damage, as well as 5d6 Radiant or Necrotic. Take a guess as to which damage you're going to get. Yeah, so 10d6. And be knocked prone. A creature that succeeds on the saving throw takes half as much damage and isn't knocked prone. So it's a big fuck you AoE. You also can choose your targets in this AoE as well. Yep. yep. I've used it a couple times. I knew what it was. I'm like, please, I don't want this. <laughs> yeah, it's scary. Yeah. He had big, he had big bursts. Like his damage was just big bursts, which was really, really. He decimated the, the Discord devil. I was like, fuck yeah, I summoned a big one this time. And he just said, I'm sorry, but the moment he saw it, he went, fuck no. that. And he switched the swords around and got the, the attack bonus. It's, so. it's, 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 the fuck, it's the fucking Taco Bell dong, but it has the bone cracking sound on top of it. <laughs> <laughs> the Mortal Kombat x-ray. But it's a I was sad. I had it cheat out and everything. And I'm like, maybe it'll live. And then no, it died instantly. And I was like, fuck. Oh, but... But Damn. I mean, it's better. It's better on that than on Remy or like one of you I, guys. I am. I, I am so sad. Like the only thing I'm upset about is that my trap didn't fucking work. I know. I was like, yeah. oh, that's so good. But I'm like, he's got the legendary. I I know. Stuff. But you know what? He bled it, so that's fine. Mm -hmm. Also, I I think you guys picked up on, but the legendary action was that he could absorb one of the swords to get its health back to him mm -hmm. instead. Yep. Yeah. So, so the more fine. damage we did was would have been less accumulative health. Exactly. Is yeah, it is so. it current health of the sword or the sword's max HP? How much? No, it was the, much it was the current health, health of the sword. Okay. How much? How much health did uh, the, the swords have individually? The swords each had eighty health. Jesus. Oh. Oh. <laughs> yeah. We did uh, no. damage. You did, yeah. Well, he absorbed the, he absorbed one of them for eighty HP because someone did like I think it was like a crit sneak attack did like yeah. a shit ton of damage and it basically if he went past like a hundred HP because he had a hundred and I'd have to double check he had a hundred and something HP it was like hundred and eighty or something like that when it went to a hundred he would he would in his mind heal himself so there was one point where he got mm. below and you kept counterspelling him so in his head he's like well then fuck this I'm just gonna get back this you know get back this health because I need it because holy shit. Yeah. But yeah, no. So his thing was like, do I heal a lot or do I sacrifice my buffs? Essentially was his his whole thing. Right. So Thank yeah. God we're a DPS team. <laughs> well, I was scared with all the damage because you guys, no offense, Connor, but you guys don't have like a cleric or mm -hmm. you know, like a dedicated core yeah. healer. Yeah, but, but here's the thing. We had items. Lots yeah. and lots and lots of items. 
You sure did, yeah. We did not um, spare our elixirs. <laughs> no, we did not. No, we did I, I told you guys, too. I'm like, listen, if you got shit, use it. Like, this is the time to use it. But uh, what do we want to name this goddamn episode? That's, that's a real dance. question. I... I I Man. honestly like I honestly like too close to the sun. Too close to the sun. I like did that. We like, use that though. I don't think we did. I don't think we did. No. Also, I know. It's, I it's it's good because it fits with Icarus. Who? Yeah. yeah. Then then let's go with that then. Too close to the too sun. Too close okay. to the sun. Too close to the sun. I'll need to check. Hang on. I'll I'll do a, I'll do a real quick check. Yeah. Please, please do check because we're running up into names that I feel like we've reached already. Yeah. I won't have much left. I know. I also I don't want to say I anything. I smacked but... my hand, and now my hand is all tingling. Oh no! <laughs> uh, also, uh, the like the next Unexpectables, like you guys session. I I would like to name the next episode. Absolutely. Um, okay. Fair enough. Yeah. If you guys are okay with relinquishing that to me, I would like to name. Mm, yeah. It. Sure. Go for it. I wonder if we're gonna get to two hundred. Yeah. Well, Might the. Hit. These one-offs are going to count as episodes, so that's going to be mm -hmm. pretty... What pretty is this one? 193? 190, 192. Yeah. This is 192. 192. So plus seven is going plus to be... Plus seven and then our last one? Yeah. It's yeah. Weird, I believe. Oh, I have, uh, someone said uh, episode 138 used it, apparently. Uh, 138. Yeah, so we're going to have to come up with a different name. Let me, let me make sure. I'm scrolling through. Damn. Uh, yep, yeah. yep. Too close. I mean, to I, the guess sun, it, I guess it. I guess it kind of gives it away a little bit. It does a um, little bit, yeah. Um, well, that's the episode we first met Icarus, I think, as well. Well, we could we could scroll through our business and see uh, if there's uh, some recommendations. Yeah, there's some recommendations. Yeah. Um. We should do. Our I, might, I might be very okay. choosy about names for a reason, but indeed. Oh, yeah. oh, wait. So Cooper Tales gave me. So Cooper Tales says uh, to the end and back. What about to the end? No. Ah, uh, okay. No. Nothing that involves the end can be in this episode title. I'm gonna say. Gotcha. That right now. Can't gotcha. mention the end at all. Hmm. <laughs> so okay. said, here comes the sun, dude. <laughs> <laughs> I was about to say, like, I, I know this doesn't, like, mean anything, but it is sun-related, and it would, like, just be, like, for a one word, sunspot. I, I kind of like Dawn of the Final Day. Mm. Dawn yeah, that's of pretty the final good. Day. I kind of yeah. like Dawn of the Final Ooh. Day as well. Maybe. Black yeah, Hole Sun would get us in trouble legally. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Marty, I hope you're happy. I'm not going to sleep tonight. I, yeah. I'm... I feel many emotions right now, and I um, think this is the first time I've said out loud that this is kind of, you know, leading up to the end of the unexpected. And I'll, I'll, I'll have you know, this was a big lift up from what I told you earlier tonight. Oh yeah, you guys, you guys did really fucking well. I was like, you guys worked so. It's amazing to look back on like how earlier you guys we would have, you know, we talk after the stream, and there's a lot of like we gotta work together more. And now seeing you guys here now with that fight and you're all fucking working together so perfectly, mm -hmm. it's just like, man, that's not just character growth in game. That's character growth out of game. And I'm so proud yeah, of you guys. Yeah. Hell yeah. Like, oh. Goodness gracious. Man. Don't we hear should... the speaker. <laughs> <laughs> we should Season probably start reading stuff speaker. off, though. I'm yeah. pretty sure there's a do we yeah, want we to should... do outro? We should, yeah. All right, uh, we'll start with Bosco. Where can they find you, and what do you go to? I I don't even know. Here, I guess. <laughs> How you uh, feeling, buddy? <laughs> I don't yeah. know. I honestly don't know. Speaks a thousand words, man. Hmm. But yeah, you can find me here. Yeah. All right, Gaijin, where can they find you, and what do you go to? Uh, you could find me here at this time over at Colonel Chair's channel on Thursdays. Uh, I'm still making culture and gaming videos. I'm still streaming Tuesday, Saturday, Sunday. M Pokemon Legends. I fuck. Mm -hmm. Okay, yeah, that's me. Oh. Zito, we're gonna find you, and what are you up to? 
Twitch.tv slash Zito. Indie games. I'm putting more of an emphasis on them once again because I want to showcase cool fucking video games that people may have grazed over uh, up until Elden Ring comes out, in which I will be playing the shit out of. Uh, as for my D&D content, please support the Patreon because that's the best way you're going to get all the new content and it's also going to be one of the best ways to find out what I'm working on. Uh... Here, click this funny hoo hoo ha ha Twitter link because unfortunately I sometimes run on deaf ears when I talk about it, so I thought maybe making a meme might get people excited. God right. fucking damn it. <laughs> Connor, can you be a bit more loud in your microphone as well? Like, actually, okay. Like, yeah. Uh, Monty, where can they find you as well? You can find me at Monty Glue on Twitter, and you can find me at twitch.tv forward slash Monty Glue. Tomorrow will be uh, Dungeon of the Mad Mage at 7 p.m. PST. Uh, join four huge dork ass losers as they go through a dungeon, and oops, they turned a corner and immediately ran into a god, god dang beholder. So we're going to start the session off with that, which will be really interesting. And the other nice thing about that, too, is it's all up on my, my personal YouTube as well. And you can just drop in because it's just a big dungeon crawl. You don't really need any continuity for the most part. All you need to know is that they have a cart and they have a revenant buddy, and he he's looking for revenge. And that's all you need to know. <laughs> you told me about the revenant. Oh yeah, he's he's he's, he's great. <laughs> but uh, yeah, I'm writing it as written too. So there's very little homebrew in there. Um, it's mostly just like the pure adventure. So if you want to just see like actual Wizards of the Coast content, check it out. I think it's great, and I've been having uh like. I'm going to have, like, a good time, so. Yeah. All right. And they can find me on Twitter, Twitch, Instagram.com, Spice, and Social, the whole rest stream Tuesdays, Fridays, Saturdays, and Sundays. Uh, going to be streaming um, b -b 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 on Friday, Friday Funhouse. It's going to be... Uh, Uh, gonna be uh fun, yeah. Not sure what we'll be playing. Maybe some Monster Hunter. Who knows? Um, Woo. Saturday I'll be playing uh Yakuza Five Remastered, and Sunday I'll be playing Banner Saga. I'm gonna try to get back into streaming a little bit. I think. Uh, you won't won't have much else to do. <laughs> mm. Um. Well, yes. Uh, do you mind if I just addendum to one thing real quick? No! Oh, okay. Oh, jeez. Oh. Alright, I'll go fuck myself. <laughs> I'm sorry, that one Charlie bit just always kills me every time. Uh, Charlie bit me. I have, I, I, I have a schedule. It's, I stream Tuesdays, Fridays, and weekends are whenever the fuck I feel. So that's my schedule now. Indeed. Uh, all right, and uh, yes, indeedy. Um, this Good episode sir. was brought to you in part by Ro uh, Die Hard Dice. We'll all right. It again. Oh yeah. <laughs> Oh yeah! Uh, thank you, Die Hard Dice, for rolling two twenties in a row on a disadvantage roll, and I dropped one immediately. <laughs> but you may listen. The, a rainbow dice had had one last hurrah just now. It really did. Mm. That and the Dracona dice that I have, this beautiful silver dice. In Didi, in Didi Babidi, uh, <laughs> which is my new Lollafell character's name. Uh, <laughs> Uh, yes, uh, if you want to pick up some dice and dice accessories, head on over to dieharddice.com. Use the code UNEXPECTABLES, exclamation point, to save 10% on your order at Die Hard Dice. Uh, that's right, I'll bow down before Diana. She is like... <laughs> <laughs> don't get Diana, Diana. Don't, don't, don't get her get in trouble, Diana though. In don't, trouble. <laughs> don't say anything that'll get her in yeah, trouble. Don't, <laughs> don't send vague, mess vague yet threatening messages to Die Hard Die saying Diana did something. That's We're dumb. not joking, by the way. Please don't yeah, do that. Do not, no, this is... that, that will get us into trouble, legitimately. All right, all right, all right, all right New York, actual fucking, like, real Frank New York voice. Don't fucking do it. All right? Don't fucking do that. Cool, I'm back to Zito now.
Okay. Oh my god, Zen. Indeedy Bambini's sworn enemy of Teeny Von Weenie. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Uh, That's our yes. legatus, man. Shut yeah. <laughs> um well I guess I guess that'll take us to some uh Nico Koss, thank you for the eight months. Uh ten minutes late. What did I miss? Everything. <laughs> <laughs> uh like Dubuya, thank you for gifting a tier one sub to level one Eevee. Hey, we know that person. Yeah. Wow. God, LJ's gonna hate this episode. <laughs> oh yeah, I hope she's doing okay too. Yeah, she's not feeling super well. Yeah. Uh do, 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 do. Razor Brownie, thank you for the 18 months. It sounds horrific. Uh <laughs> Doppelganger's Douse, thank you for the 12 months. Thanks to probably not there for my gift sub. The demon who invented NFTs, thank you for the 22 <laughs> months. Death. <laughs> Mm. I just wanted to make an economy based on funny pictures and waifus. I didn't think humans would take it this far. <laughs> Pixel uh, Belladonna, thank you for the eight months. Can't stick around for this one, unfortunately. Got work to do. However, I do wish you luck in your solar shaking endeavors, and I wish I could impose forever disadvantage on your enemies via poisoning. You fool. Most things are immune to poison. Remember, you can... by, by third tier, everything is immune to poison and fear. Listen, just sneeze on your fist to inflict poison damage. It's true. <laughs> Rikaku the Psychro, thank you for the training run months. Uh, 10,000 armored bees, thank you for the 22 months. Jesus. 5% chance, thank you for the raid with a party of 15. That's such a oh, cool yeah. name. <laughs> yeah. 5% chance of what? Um. <laughs> uh. Char Avner, thank you for the 11 months. Humdrum Gum, thank you for the 21 months. Funny Brass Devil goes... <laughs> yeah, it's just sad. Oh. Yeah. It, it literally plays the, the fucking prices right. <laughs> Slowly <As> deflating. It <laughs> uh, it's the fucking big band happy birthday. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Icaro Slanding, thank you for the 22 months. Shaggy952, thank you for the 17 months of Prime. CRJ Joe, thank you for the 7 months. Good luck, catch y'all in the VOD. Hemihead NHRA, thank you for the 22 months. Wow, that's a lot of months. Indeed. Uh. Ac Arc. Our Clumiere, thank you for the four months. Hey, hey, had some money left for my Christmas gift card, so I subbed. Uh, Remy lived, though. Oh, boy. Gaben's Prophet, thank you for the nine months. Go save the world, you crazy bastards. May Lord Gaben bless your rolls. Gabe's busy making the stream deck, and it's going to be coming out soon. I hope it was worth the wait. We're, we're, he's actually selling it at a loss, too, by the way. Wow. God. It's it's a 70% loss to make it right now. That's what he said. That's insane. Cuz he yet, he cuz he fucking knows the long con that everyone's going to buy one. Yeah, it's going to fucking sell like crazy. <laughs> the switch uh, killer. Oh, oh, no, I don't think so. I, Faye, I think Raven, so. Faye Raven, thank you for the 22 months. Happy 22 months. One day I'll be able to watch live, but for now, I will have to watch the vod. And thank you for Gifting 10 subs to the community, Fay Raven. Mortalia, thank you for the 22 months. Go forth, Unexpectables. Let's go. <laughs> Saw the meme Monty put in the chat. <laughs> uh -oh. yeah, thanks, Zalita, for that one. Oh. It's, it's the, uh, it's from... Brooklyn Nine-Nine with the... <laughs> with, uh, with, um... I forget the main character's name, but he's he's pointing at the corgi who's just sitting there smiling at him. Don't and blow it's, it. Up. It's it's the guest stars is the corgi and the unexpectables is the guy, and he's saying, "Don't blow this for us." <laughs> uh, Figgly Puff, thank you for the three months of Prime. Three months. One day I'll be a Figgly Tough. Oh, holy shit! Damn. Mad Wombat Man, thank you for the 18 months. Like Tabuya, thank you for the 200 bits. Seriously, everyone, amazing job. You killed the session, and I'm ex so excited. Uh, Magic Ninjago, 10 years to spin Jitsu. Thank you for the 100 bits. 
oh yeah, I just went and saw No Way Home, and guess and the guest stars actually get to join in on the stuff. It's Endgame. Everyone is here. Everyone is here. I am screaming in a fuckload of pain. pain. My immune system is fading away. Breathe. <laughs> and I am uh, in one year. I doubt highly I'll survive till the end of the one year. year. Da, 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 da. Death the Kid, thank you for the 300 bits. I don't want this to be the end. I've been listening to this show for the past three years. It's helped me get out of dark places. I even got married. Sad to see that it's ending. Mm. Kane time. Thank you for the 500 bits. I missed the game because I got uh, run into a game myself. So I'll see you all in the VODs. Ooh. Black I hope you succeed. Yeah. What the? <laughs> Is there a oh, guess? yeah, Alexa. <laughs> Is there a ghost? Take out the trash. Take out the trash. <laughs> oh, God. We did. <laughs> you sure fucking did. Blackfoot Ferret, thank you for the elite bits. Old school emotes. Let's do this. Uh, Namor Kale, thank you for the 1500 bits. Uh, episode title, What Lies in Darkness. Uh, looking forward to seeing how this all ends. Like Dabuya, thank you for the 100 bits. Episode title, The Sun Sets. Colonel Cheru, thank you for the 16 months. Thanks to probably another mayor for my gift sub. Fantastic Callum, thank you for the 100 bits. Oh my god, I can't even. That boss fight was amazing and so tense. Everyone got a nice moment to shine, and that ending, the dark, unexpectable theme was haunting, and we get to see the guest stars all come in one more time. I can't even. Mm. I want the next 10 or so Wednesday days to happen right now! Now! But our friends... Yeah. In our home, Jesus. <laughs> just, just like all the unexpectable sitting in like director seats with glasses, like <laughs> sipping on fucking like drinks and shit. Oh, hey, if you're going through the city, don't root through my stuff. <laughs> mm -hmm. Don't touch my shit, or I'll kill you. I'll mount your head on my wall. Uh. Slowly sweating about Greckles's freaking hentai collection stuffed under his bed. <laughs> fucking ye olde hentai. And it's just all photorealistic birds. <laughs> Yo, if I find out you found my eels and one of them is missing, I'll kill you. <laughs> <laughs> Don't touch my eels. Uh, eh, 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 faceless 42. Thank you for the 11 bits. Episode title, And So the Sun Sets. Lovely Lorelei, thank you for the 100 bits. Uh, so is this like a, a month-long break counted as a long rest for the characters? <laughs> we go to stasis. We're just, we're just, lies, lies, and us are just sitting in a corner with like hugging our knees and just looking around. We get, we get fucking shelved like Sora in fucking Kingdom Hearts two. <laughs> <laughs> Anybody want to play Tiddlywinks? <laughs> I got dice. Uh, Zizo the Dark Witch. Thank you for the fifteen bits. Uh, glad Roll20 was merciful with you tonight, Unexpectables. In a D&D game I'm in, I rolled five natural ones, and my sister is using the rainbow dice from Die Hard Dice. Rolled five natural 20s. The oh DM even God. asked if I wanted to switch to real dice, and my sister changed dice. Thank you, Die Hard Dice, even with the free metal D20 that I wanted. Uh, and good luck, everyone, in their one-shots. Ooh, you got a free metal one? Fuck Dang. yeah. Yeah, Die Hard Dice usually includes, uh... Little free sets of dice if if you order from Die Hard Dice. Sometime. Yeah, depending on what you order, yeah, they'll send you little freebies yeah. and stuff like that. It's very fun. Yeah. Burr, 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 burr. Fantastic, Callum. Thank you for the uh, 10 bits. Episode title Attack of the Darkness. <laughs> That's good, or, though! Or that is good. good. That's kind of good, good though! Yeah, that's kind of good, yeah. yeah. Mm. Considering everything. Oh, that's fucking good, though! Has it been yeah. used? Yeah, I'll write this down. No. <laughs> I kind of like that attack. I do, darkness. too! Oh, my God! I'm gonna, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna put that one down. You hear that, Alexa? You might get an episode title. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God, Alexa! It doesn't give anything away, either. That's the mm -hmm. good thing, too. Yeah! yeah! And it's got double meanings for memes! Zen Lita, thank you for the 100 bits. Monty, next time you say you're not good at writing stories, I'm going to link you the entire last sequence of this session. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Just grab the back of your head to the computer screen. Look at it! 
Listen, it's a team effort, so. <laughs> yes, but you are the linchpin. That's true, I guess. <laughs> they, they, <laughs> At least she admitted. <laughs> uh, Volk551, thank you for the bit. That was his name, Daedalus. I looked that up. That's the name of Icarus's father. Mm, but okay. I don't think it has enough to be an episode title. I'm very sorry. But it is a very cool reference. I actually had to look that up because I didn't know that's that was it's what really that... a really cool name. It's a very cool name, yeah. Crazy Meta, thank you for the 20 months. Episode title, Fallen from Grace. Oof. That one's good, too. I do like Attack the Darkness, yeah, though, a bit yeah. better. That is still it, a really good title, though. It also it also sets it up to be kind of like funny haha hoo hoo and all things considered. Uh-oh. You guys had some funny moments. <laughs> uh, you, you thought you were getting memes, but it was me, story! Now I need to take off my Udi. It's too hot in here now. <laughs> The duality of man, Udi on and Udi off. <laughs> oh. uh, Hi, Minmo. Hi, Minmo. Minmo is here. Grow up strong Minmo. and healthy, Minmo. Hi, baby. That's nice. Sorry, you may keep going. I'm just going to grab something to eat. I'm hungry again. Yeah. yeah. Oh, God, Minmo. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> Minmo. Uh, crazy meta episode title, Fallen from Grace, uh, with the 20 months of Prime. Real Tech Bandit, thank you for the 200 bits. Dawn of the Final Day. Brian Merrill, thank you for the 50 bits. Uh, I think just naming the episode Icarus fits as an episode title. It gives it away, though, unfortunately. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, Chew Bacon, thank you for the 200 bits. <laughs> episode title, Falling on Melting Wings. Uh... Giveaway. Mm. Yeah. Gauss 21, thank you for the six bits. Episode title, Broken Sun. Flustered Bun, thank you for the 100 bits. We love you guys. Love you too, everybody. And I love you, random citizen. Dippin' Bipples, thank you for the 100 oh, bits. <laughs> <laughs> I waited for the exact moment you put something in your mouth. <laughs> Got him. I inhaled cookie. <laughs> <laughs> You gonna be okay? Let's say, let me get my milk. I'm gonna mute myself. <laughs> Don't say that, cause what if we say dip in bipples? Fuck! You just said it. <laughs> no. <laughs> Great, you've killed our TM. Yeah, she muted at the right time, cause then we would have heard. <laughs> if she never unmutes, it's gonna be an uh oh moment. <laughs> <laughs> Will you guys uh, shut up? You're gonna cause. <laughs> I fucking got her, Chad. I got her. <laughs> I was, I was, I, I had my mouth because my milk had like a like an aluminum, <laughs> aluminum foil thing on top of it, and like I went to like use my mouth to rip it off, and you joked, and I like literally rammed my tooth into the top oh, of the milk. No. <laughs> I fucking got her. Holy shit! <laughs> oh. oh my god. Got him. Oh, keep, fuck. Keep going. Two sharks, thank you for the 100 bits. Uh, episode title, Black Sun Rising. <sighs> Tear Dex, thank you for the 500 bits. Episode title, Too Far From The Sun. That eh, still gives it away. Give away. Zizo the Dark Witch, thank you for the bit. Also, uh, I and other player were using Roll20 that day. Ah, I'm sorry. Uh, potential episode title, Drifting <coughs> Directionless. Hmm. Mm, that's also good. That's okay. I like that. Fantastic, Callum. Thank you for the 40 bits. Uh, I've got to prepare my tear ducts for the next couple of episodes. Oh. Magic Ninjago. Thank you for the 100 bits. Uh, Gaijin said Pokemon Legends. Then I guess I'll have to ask, who are you picking? I'm going with Oshawott. I mean, I've, ma I've already made it obvious. Is it the owl? I bet it's the owl. I've, I've already made it obvious. I bet it's the owl, Gaijin. I've already made it obvious. I bet, it, I bet it's the fucking owl, Gaijin. Is it the ninja one? No, it's probably the owl, because because why why not? Oh, wait, um, I know why, because it's the best one. Yeah, bitch. <laughs> Mad Monk Montague, thank you for the 300 bits. Amazing episode. Thank you for this epic adventure, awesome characters, and fantastic story. Like to Booyah, one, two, three. Think of the 100 bits. I'm so proud of you guys, and I'm anxious for the end that's coming, but so thankful to have been a part of the journey with this community, and I am so excited for what comes next. 
Gauze 21, thank you for the 100 bits. Uh, Grekos. Senso. Otashka shite iru wa senso dake desu. I need the kanji for that. Uh, it's it's in. It, yeah, I know. It's, it's in, in Romanji. <laughs> yeah, I no, know. It's in English. Go, go That's on, Romanji, sorry. fool! Is it? Yes. Gaijin, wow. Gaijin, Gaijin. Gaijin. Yeah. Gomena, sorry. That's okay. Missed it's the, it's Daijo Bouquet. He did it! Oh my god! I'm I'm he's, getting he's everyone he's tonight. So, he's so jaded. <laughs> Holy uh, shit, Miss he used the reverse Uno card and I took psychic <laughs> damage. <laughs> Miss Tweedums, thank you for the 1,000 bits. It's so surreal to me right now. I've been here since the very first live stream and now I'm going to be here for the end game. Uh, I'll Damn. probably say it once more, but thank you all. Thank you all so much. You have no idea what this means to me. Yeah. Yeah. I actually got like a fucking spinning headache, but I'm finger gunning at you right now, my dude. <laughs> <laughs> Fantastic, Callum. Thank you for the 50 bits. Here's a pun. What do you call a dragon dude going through an immersion? What do you call a dragon dude going through an emotional whirlpool? Uh, you get me because this campaign has been so amazing for me. When Aww. I found you guys two years ago, every week has been able to keep my head up from everything thanks to you guys. I didn't think you guys would legitimately save me on those days, but I guess it was pretty unexpectable. Oh, glad to hear it, dude. Right on, man. Uh, <clears throat> Doom Knight 13, thank you for the 200 bits. Uh, here's a little bit more bits. Good job on killing the sun guy. Also, uh, I I like one more to shout out to Pangolin. I love pangolins. They're cute. That... Pangolins are pretty cute. Oh no, that was my sleeper activation. <laughs> Goodbye. Oh god. <laughs> <laughs> you thought to assassinate someone. <laughs> uh, e e e e e e e Argent Lyal, thank you for the 500 bits. Die Hard Dice is amazing. When I ordered a set of dice for my first time DMing, they also sent me a free Metal D20 and DMing tips. The mm. team over there is amazing. Yeah, that's why we love working with them. Yeah, they're really great. They're at their heart, they're all big nerds, which is perfect. Oh, they're huge nerds. They're not a bunch of people in suits going, oh, business, business, business. Hmm, roll dice business, yes. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Roll dice business. Big slappy, thank you for the 500. <laughs> <laughs> That's Zito's dipping pimples right there. <laughs> I love saying it. Big slappy. I <laughs> uh, love you guys so much. I've been watching live since episode one. You guys have helped me out through so much, even helping meet my girlfriend. I can't wait Ooh. to see Yo. and watch the final episode. And more? Hmm. Strokes beard. Rubs chin. 1-800-R-U-SLAP. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck off! <laughs> Kuro Kami, thank you for the bit. Episode title, Black Hole Sun. Yeah, we said we can't use that one. Yeah. Can't use it. Sorry. We'll get smanged by... Who does that one? I don't know. Metallica, because why not? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I was, okay, you know what? I was about to correct you, but then when you said that, I'm like, nah, that flies. <laughs> <laughs> this Lars comes in. Yeah, I did that. <laughs> I got my. I, I set up the system that got my so own fucking music banned on Twitch. Dumbass. Fucking dumbass. <laughs> uh, uh, lovely Laurel, I think for the 100 bits. Uh, this is a little esoteric, but Labyrinth of Darkness for a title. Mm. It's cool sounding, but I don't think it it's fits cool, enough. but I think it's a giveaway. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Thank you, though. Uh, like, anyone who's suggested, even if we've turned down, like, naming suggestions, thank you so much for offering them, at least. Yeah, yeah, yeah no, like, don't, don't, it, don't yeah. take our neglect as, like, you know, don't, don't take our neglect as, as a negativity, because these no. would be cool, but for reasons we can't. Yeah. yeah. We always love hearing them either way. Mm-hmm. Uh... Mm -mm -mm. Uh, Volk551, thank you for the bit. And this is Jeremy, your only source of hellish entertainment. Ah. <laughs> how'd, you, how'd, you up, how'd you end up in the pitch black hell dimension, Jeremy? <laughs> Tash just like fucking punches him in the stomach. Dude, I told you I was going to say that. 
I told you I was gonna do that. I told her, like, dude, I warned you. I was told you I was gonna do that again. I can't do Zach. I can't do Zach's voice at all. It's impossible. Uh, episode title uh, suggested by Nico Koss for 100 bits. Never die easy. Mm, that's also quite good. Mm. Mm. Uh, Mexican skydiver, thank you for the 100 bits. Thank you guys for so many laughs throughout the years. You brought the hobby back into my mind. I will definitely miss the world of Alabas, but to make reference for Final Fantasy 14, walk to the end and forge ahead. Ooh. Mm. I get that. Hey, Monty, did you play Endwalker yet? No, <laughs> shut up. <laughs> I was waiting for that. <laughs> oh Jesus! I'm, I'm gonna post a meme. My, my arm, my arms are crossed right I'm, now. I'm, I'm gonna scowling. post a meme that I made for everyone in this chat. Here, here, guys. She can't see this, but you can. <laughs> <laughs> ah yes. Honestly, Zeta, if, if you just put your cackle, like, starting up in that video, like, the last half, it'd be perfect. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Flustered bun. Thank you for the five bits. Uh, well, when this all ends, you know what to do. Watch it all over again on YouTube. But seriously, I appreciate all that you've done. I wouldn't be here in this community without you all. Bubba Bob. Thank you for the 500 bits. Uh, uh, oh, god damn it, it's been a while. <laughs> if Apocalypse Games made a game where you play as villains who fight against heroes, it would be called Legacy of Stain. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck off. <laughs> We're back with the Dead House Sonata puns, I see. Come on, it's classic. Yeah, that's a classic. Mm, it's a vintage. Mwah. Vintage, uh, 1895. What a meme. <laughs> Mangetsu Tatsumasa, thank you for the 100 bits. I got a title name, Sundial, because of the sun's rotating. Ooh. That, I should have named the ability that. Damn it. That would have been really oh, smart. Oh, that would have been cool. Quick, write this down. Write this down. <laughs> <laughs> write it down. <laughs> uh, Nico Kost, thank you for the 100 bits. Thank you, Gaijin, for making the Greckles breakdown video. If you didn't... If you didn't, I would have never had the absolute pleasure of watching you guys play. Oh, dude, I'm not even close to being done with D&D &D and, like, cultural analysis shit. Oh, my God. What's the cultural analysis uh, uh, video on the Namir? Mm. <laughs> you know, it's midnight. <laughs> mm. You know, it's midnight. No, when is it, though? Oh, it's midnight. <laughs> The Atom Bomb, um, thank you for the 100 bits. I can't say that I've been here since episode one or made the most art or the most donations, but you guys have made me a better DM and a better player and also a better role player. Thank you. I hope uh, the end coming is more like Dragon Ball going into Dragon Ball Z. Who knows? Yo, but, but th yo, real talk, Spread though? Around and find it out. D real talk, though. It doesn't matter that if you didn't give enough, if you didn't give a lot of bits, subs, whatever, what have you, artwork, whatever, the oh, fact yeah. that you're here rules, dude. Mm -hmm. The fact that you're here and you show up and yeah. you want to listen, fucking speaks so mega people. volumes. We if had over if a I thousand people in here tonight, if I could have anything, I would want as many people to see like the 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 final episode or the episodes leading up anything as much as possible. That's always like, mm -hmm. that to me is always a big thing. It's just like, I want a lot of people to enjoy this show and a lot of people to watch it. And I, mm -hmm. I want it, my work to be good and I want to be happy with it. And, and you know what, today I'm really happy. I'm like sitting here kind of partially like, huh, but also like, yeah, because <laughs> hey. it might went well. But... <laughs> Cosmos is 45, thank you for the 100 bits. Not sure this, if this is copyright risky, but how about the episode titled Swords of Revealing Light? Oh my oh god. god. Oh god. That's just pain. <laughs> Pot of greed, what does it do? I don't know. Oh, oh god. No one does. Pseudonymic fake name, thank you for the 100 bits. Ha ha ha! Episode title, Red Sun Over Paradise. Red Sus. 
Uh, Venmaru Kaurus Corwin, thank you for the 700 bits. I, like many others, cannot express in mere bits how much entertainment this show has brought me, but more than that, you've inspired people to play this fantastic game called Dungeons and Dragons. Without you guys, I would have never had the gumption to DM for my group. So sincerely, thank you. Fuck yeah. Yeah, dude. The we real love this hobby. Oh yeah. I fucking I just look at how many games I'm in. Fuck you man. have a problem, all right? You're yeah. different. I, I, actually, <laughs> You're different. I actually need to start looking into more, if I'm going to be honest with you. Hmm. Hmm. The real noob, thank you for the 100 bits. Uh, I will legitimately cry when this is all over. So many memories, so much joy. This has been my favorite and basically only D&D show I listened to. I just started Prince Division and The Gateway. Uh, gonna go cry with my Zito Kobold plush in the corner now. Oh. He, if you hug him hard enough, he'll expel a knife. <laughs> Man, I'm not gonna lie. Enough, I still kind of want to go away. <laughs> I, I still kind of want to make plush. I still kind of want to make plushes of our characters. Hmm. I mean, that might be cool down the road. Hmm. A lot of people wanted a log plush. Hmm. That was something a lot of people were asking for. I mean, do you blame them? This, this is no. my this is my uh, beard stroking contemplation noise. Hmm. Uh. Bob, thank you for the one hundred bits. So, when the unexpected ends, are you going to get that Gaijin Goomba analysis video on the Oni? Oh shit! Oh. God, um... Oh, right. you'll do that one! Right. It's, you know, shut up! <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna come over there with, like, money and... Oh, I, uh, no, I don't and... fucking understand. Bleh. I know what hurts you, Zito. Kindness. Come get me, bitch. <laughs> I'm gonna Hell make Robot. you feel... I'm gonna make you feel so fucking loved. Hell <laughs> Robot, thank you for the 100 bits... Cheers to another great episode. I've been watching you guys live for about four years, and while I'm sad to see it's all coming to an end, I'm sure these final episodes will be amazing, and I can't wait for next week. <sighs> Dice Ruler, think of the bit. You're still on. Hmm. Don't know what that means. Are you eating anything, Monty? No. Dip and Bipples, thank you for the 100. <laughs> <laughs> it's, I was so confused. I'm like, why? And then I'm like, oh, wait. And then you said it. <laughs> God damn it. You missed one of my bits, but I wanted to say thank you guys for helping me get through a family member's death and a bad breakup. Uh, sorry oh, to hear geez. that, dude. Sorry, sorry man. Your bit. Yeah, we need to figure out like a, a something different than Streamlabs. <laughs> Fucking. We've been dealing Unfortunately, with it's like that situation where it's just like they've been around for so long and are the biggest one that it's like hard to find competition. Yeah, it's hard to make something better, mm -hmm. unfortunately. Hmm. I think I could help with that. But anyway, we'll look, we'll look uh, into it. But for now, look into it. I'll, I'll put on my goggles and uh, we'll I'll look into it. Dice Ruler, thank you for the uh, six bits. I miss you so much. <laughs> oh, I, oh, I missed so much. Uh -huh. Oh, yes, you did. <laughs> I miss you, too, man. <laughs> uh, Cyborg Raptor, thank you for the 69 bits. Unexpectables taught me how to play D&D. Oh, God. So Jesus Christ. <laughs> <laughs> but if Unexpectables starred horses, would it be the unex un one expect stables? I mean, maybe. Check out our My Little Pony one shot. Oh, yeah. No horsing around. Indeed. Uh, I am Spite. Thank you for the 400 bits. I'm going to plan to get my booster so I can take a sick leave and watch the finale. Uh, I'm only doing this now because I know I'll sob like a baby the entire way through, like I did at the end of Marley and Me. Will, oh, will, will it be because of the ending or the pain from the shot? <laughs> Poor Kano <sighs> Uh Dice Ruler, thank you for the four bits. Is there going to be another campaign? Hmm. I don't know. Mm. Mm. Uh, flustered bun thank you for the two bits uh, one last time because my bits got eaten episode title Skyfall <laughs> <laughs> alright is that it Vote for not. bits you decide yes alrighty so uh, I have a recommendation of who to raid I do as well but what do you got uh, Arkolf, because Arkolf's yes. been sick. 
He's been super sick. He hasn't been able to stream for a while, so giving him a little bit of a little encouragement, I think, would be really nice for him. Yeah, he's been, all right. he's been That's out fair. for a long time. Yeah. Do it up. All right. Well, we'll already that's for our call. <laughs> Don't go into the light. <laughs> uh, hmm. Uh... Oh, what should we? What should our raid message be? Mm. Be... Emotions, <laughs> just emotions with exclamation marks. Yeah, that's good. Actually, get, get all the crying emojis you got. Just cry emotions. on him. Yeah, just eat, uh, emo emotions and just drop every fucking sad emoji you got. No context. <laughs> Take care, everybody. Oh. Later. Have a goodbye, everyone.